everybody doing tonight? It's a Ross is in the house today. How are you guys doing? Just uh, starting off the show. That's what we're doing right now. Just getting it all set up here. Getting it ready to rock, ready to roll. Got lots of uh, interesting stuff. Um, it's pretty cool. We got a few things we're going to go over in a minute. We're going to do the rules and all that kind of stuff and shipping and stuff. Because everybody always asks me those kind of questions. Uh, I'm usually the one uh, in the background. Uh, my brother's not here tonight. He uh, left me uh, on on with, with uh, Mike here, just the two of us. <laughs> How you doing, uh, Brown Boy? All right. Yeah, I always uh, chat with Brown Boy almost every day. How you doing there? Tim Hyde is in the house. We got uh, Johnny Hahn is in the house too. That's cool. We got all kinds of cool stuff. I'm, I'm just going to go through what we got. But first, let's start out what we have to do. First of all, if you're new to the program, we have a couple auction rules. You got to be 18 years or older to be doing the any of the bidding. And uh, you got 72 hours to pay for your cars. Now, that's when we send you the invoice. So don't panic. If you haven't got an invoice, just let me know. And then it's probably because we didn't get your email information correct and that kind of stuff. All right. So Tiny Man has joined us as well. That's cool. All right. So just so we know, and then we have bidding increments of a dollar. Just uh, just so we do that. Make sure we do that. Just kind of keep to those rules. Now, how does it work? You have to do. You have to go to diecasttv.com to register. That's important. And that way you verify your PayPal information to make sure it's actually a working PayPal. And then you submit your name and address, shipping address, and make sure we have that so we can. <laughs> how you doing, Joseph? Uh, so we can actually uh, get the stuff to you. <laughs> That's the important thing. All right, and then we do a little bit uh, differently on shipping, okay? So we get things rolling on shipping. We do a dollar per car, and there's usually, we have a country code or what I call shipping handling rate. In the U.S., it's $3.50, and it's a dollar a car after that. In Canada, it's $13.50. That's where if you live there, and it's a dollar a car after that. Internationally, it's $23.50 and a dollar a car after that. Now, if you do $50 or more in one evening, hey, you get free shipping. That's awesome if you're in the U.S. If you're $100 or more and you're international, hey, you get free shipping too. So that's pretty cool. Tiny Man, how are you doing, buddy? Haven't seen you in a long time. I've seen you in some other rooms there. And I thought I'd say hi. It's nice to see you in the house, in the house today. And, of course, uh, a free of shipping accumulates over the pro 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 uh, program of one day. So. And then, of course, the next day, the whole thing starts all over again, just like Groundhog Day. <laughs> all right, so there we go. So that's kind of cool. So first things first, I did put uh, a 69 Chevelle, and you know how I do it. I ease it in. My kind of show is I ease it in first. We'll show you in there. I got a little 69 Chevelle SS just to get things rolling slowly. All right, and there we go. So from west to east, <laughs> it's 49. That's right. <laughs> that's about right, you know. But anybody knows that if they do any shipping, and, uh, you know, if you're, or we're from Florida, we're out of St. Pete's. And since St. Pete's to California, it's probably the longest distance. And it's, uh, oh, good, good, tiny. It's, uh, you know, that's the most expensive shipping that way. And usually, you know, the flat rate boxes are in, in play in those kind of things. Or the regional boxes, of course. So we do have like a Chevelle, 69 Chevelle. I put in there a 396. And I'll put a trio of Chevelles, all right, in there. So I'm going to put a 70, what do I got here? A 70 Chevelle. Looks pretty cool. So we got this one here, this yellow one. And I'm going to put in the black Sorrel, of course, that one. I believe that one was from the year 2007, it looks like. The card does. And then this particular one is really cool. I like this one. It's a 2006 70 Chevelle as well. Okay. So we got a little bit of a trio action of Chevelles just to get the balls rolling here and get them going. And I do have some stuff in the backyard. If you do see something you want to put up, I put a couple of my... Uh, drag trucks in the backyard because i'll tell you something i just made a deal with a gentleman for 29 drag buses <laughs> 29 so i figured i might as well sell some of my stuff off and uh, you know i'll replace them later hey edgar how's you doing hey, edgar's in the house that's pretty cool all right so that's the way we got the chevelles going on there and then uh, when i got something for the showroom let's see where might i go with the showroom things i'm not sure yet let's see and so he's got a couple of supers there, but let's try, let's do this one. All right. Italian strip, nice. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. So, and then I've got this uh, club exclusive. Let me show you a customized vote so I can track drag truck. Let me show you. I finally figured out what the difference between the drag truck and the drag bus is, so that's kind of cool. Now, this one does have a number on the back. They made 7,000 of these. And this one particular is, is four nine sixty nine, and it's got the little hologram in the back there. It's a purple one. It's pretty cool looking. 
It's the RLC one. Hey, Doan Fernando. I hope that's going to do there. Is that going to be okay there? Or it's going to go forward a bit? I know it's a little bit out of focus there. Or is it going the other way? That makes it more focused. Um, uh, okay there? All right, cool. All right, so there we go. Hey, good morning, Ramon. Good morning. Hey, uh, so Wayne Farr comes in. All right, hey there, Aaron. Uh, is it Aaron? Kurt, okay, so if you're in, if you're new in the house, just make sure you go to diecasttv.com and make sure you register yourself. It's important that you do that and uh, just verify your PayPal and we'll, then you can, then you can uh, go on and bid all you want on the stuff. Uh, if you like. Uh, Wayne Farr has got three on the chefs, so that's pretty cool. So we just started nice and easy. That's how you do it. Wayne Farr has got the right idea. The way you bid, basically just put the bid in the comment section. You go from there, and then we grow that way. So that we go. So we got a little bit of easy, just a couple main lines in there. And you got Wayne Farr goes 10 on the drag truck. Okay, that's nice, but we do need to get a little bit more for that thing as well. All right, so here we go. So I'm going to let it sit there as long as we get in there. And that's my personal stuff that's in there. 15 tiny mans on the drag truck. All right, thank you. All right, so we got the two of them going there. <coughs> we got the chevs, and uh, so Wayne Farr's got three on the chevs, and we got Tiny Man on 15 on the drag truck, and that's where we're sitting right now. Hope everybody's had a good time, stayed out of the cold. I know it's we're starting to warm up here in Florida, so it's uh, that's pretty good. I like that. I like it's a little bit humid, but that's all right. Damien says 18. I'm assuming on the drag truck. I would assume that. So, all right, say hey, Jake Vineveld is in the house. I missed you guys. I missed the old crew. This is like the old crew getting back together again. That's pretty cool. All right. Fernando Doyle's in the house, too. That's awesome. Ramon is in the house. It was Star Ramon. $20, $20 says Wayne Farr on the drag truck. All right, cool. And I got the YouTube going, too. I got Bo Jeff Bo Joseph Bozeman in the in the YouTube. And I'll, I know you, I had a message to call you, Joe. Uh, I will call you, Joseph. No problem. Tiny man, you're a little bit. Hey, Steve. Steve Andrews in the YouTube. He's saying hi. So we got both sides. We got Tiny Man on 22 on the drag truck, and that's in the Facebook side of things. Now we've grown a little bit there, Tiny Man. You can actually go to YouTube and watch us, and might have a little bit less uh, lag there. Dale Nelson says 25. Now Dale, if you're new, I've, I'm not sure if I'm familiar with your name, but if you do, are new, make sure you do register at DieCastTV.com. It's an important thing to do because that's where uh, we get your name and address and all that kind of stuff, so we know where to ship it. <laughs> so just in case you get some, you get some bids in here and you win. So there, that's important. So diecasttv.com. There you see it right there in front of your screen. Uh, that's what you want to do. All right. So there you go. So all right, Steve Andrews in the house. Jesse Bose. I have all kinds of people in the house. Tiny Mess. Nice to see you all, guys. So right now we're at twenty-five dollars from Dale Nelson. Okay. <laughs> Tiny Mess says it's okay. All righty, so there we are right now, 25 bucks on that drag truck. Like I said, I have over the next, uh, probably on Saturday, it's coming when I have 29 uh, buses coming in. The chefs are only up at three, $3 right now. Are you new? All right, cool, cool, okay, that's cool, Dale, thank you. All right, out on the drag trucks, Wayne Farr says, okay, no problem, right now they're at 20, it's 25 on the drag truck and $3 on the chefs right now. Three bucks on the chefs. So let's sell off the chefs, it looks like. We'll get them going here. And right now it's Wayne Farr has got those three uh, for three bucks. And uh, four, Damian Harris has four bucks on the chefs. All right, no problem. A little bit of Chevelle actions. 70s kind of type. <laughs> all right, Damian Harris has got it right now for four, all the way from down under, of course. I think Damian's out of Sydney. Wayne Farr got his giant box. That was the one we were packing it, and uh, we're packing some big boxes going down to Australia. I have to admit, they're getting in the 20 pound to 25 pound. Wayne Farr says five dollars for the chefs. All right, he's got that, and then we got the Wayne Farr five dollars on the three chefs. We'll get a nice shot of the three in a minute there. Get some close ups going on there. That's pretty cool. Muscle media. <laughs> That's a 69 Chev, and then, of course, the next year, they, a little bit slight change. You'll see them. This is pretty cool because the stance is nice on this one, SS. It's got a nice low stance. Love it. All right, so there you go. Wayne Farr is going once. All right, now we can do it this way. We can do it one way, I call it. Or actually, better yet, let's just put up the clock. It's an easy way to do it. I like that little invention by my brother there. He's figured out the 50-second clock. Put it on there. <laughs> That's funny, Wayne Farr says. I need a forklift to bring it into my shop. 
Yeah, well, when you, when you unpack it, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be a lot of cars all over the place. I have to admit. All right, so Wayne Farr has got the paperwork right now. I've uh, written it all out for him. All right, so here we go. Going uh, once there. All right, and we're going twice to Wayne Farr right now. We got 25 seconds on the clock. It's counting down. Once it reaches uh, to the uh, last 10 seconds, and then after it hits the zero, you'll see it turns red. And that's the end of the bidding, and that's the winner. <laughs> that's the easy way to do that. All right, so we got Wayne Farr going once, going twice, and it's gone down into the red zone, as my brother calls it. S five seconds left. Four, three, two. Looks like it's going to be sold to Wayne Farr. No other takers. Sold, sold, sold. He's got it. Wayne Farr has got all three of them for five smackaronis. There you go. That's pretty cool. All right. I like these because it's not easy to find the older stuff. Sometimes you find them here and there, but not always, all right? In the meantime, we have the, the drag truck is percolating at $25 with Dale Nelson is on that one. And in the meantime, let me just, uh, you know how I do it. I like to mix up things. So I'll do one of these things. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in uh, some chargers. How are we doing with the chargers? So let's do this. Let's put up, I have a 1969 Dodge Charger. So now we had, uh, of course, we started off with some Chevs. So let's go into the Mopar action. And we got a Series 2 Classics. It's cool. Uh, the paint is awesome on this one. The Spectra Flame is nice. I love the detail on the back. It's nice, too. All right. So there we go. Got a little bit of a Charger action in there. A little Classic Series. And what I do is, you know me, I'll put in a, a few extras. So let's start the bidding on this one, at least at 5 bucks to get the ball rolling faster. So we don't have to stick around all night here. Let's get some more things. The more faster I get the bids in. Five on the charger. That's what I was thinking. Hey there, Rick. How you doing, buddy? All right. So here we go. We're going to go with the Dodge Charger. I got, a nine, I got a 71 Charger to put in there. I like this one. The paint's kind of cool on this one. And then I have another 69 Charger, which I'll put down. The card's got a little bit of a nick on the top. A little bend in it, but that's all right. Otherwise, everything else is perfect on it. So I'll just throw that in a minute. So that's pretty cool, that one. I think it's a 71 Charger. It's nice. And that particular one was of uh, 2011, I believe, that one came out in the Muscle Mania. All right, so that's six. Lewis Riders is six on the Chargers. And check this one out. So I'm going to put a trio out. You know me. The music, I'm a musician, so I like to talk like that. So we got another 69 Charger, of course. And that is pretty sweet as well. So we got them all there. on The, the hoods on the 69s open up, I believe. <laughs> Three out of my sandals. Oh, you're lucky today I have my sandals on to do. All right, so right now, Lewis a Rider has the six on the dot. Wayne Farr just now went up to ten on the Chargers. Thank you. And then what we'll do after, if you guys are in there, don't forget Dale. Dale's got the $25 bid on the RLC. All right, so that's where we're at right now. So right now, we got Wayne Farr is $10 on the Chargers. So <coughs> we'll get a quick peek of what's in the showroom there. You got the RLC drag truck. It's cool. <laughs> Mr. Piano Man. Johnny Han knows he's seen video. <laughs> it's true. He actually has uh, seen video. I was, in the, I was in the warehouse, took video, and, sh and uh, showed it to him when I was playing there. You know, we got uh, some stuff in the old warehouse there. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Let's get a roll in here. Let's get some, uh, let's see. Might as well sell this one off here. Let's see what we can do here. All right, let's just check here. I, I forgot to refresh some screens here. I got all these screens in front of me. And I'm like, I'm not using them. <laughs> it's one of those. My brother's techniques here. All right, so here we go. Let's sell off the charters. We got $10 on the charters. Wayne Farr has got these as well. Danny Mezzi, you can't, Mezzi, you can't have my sandals. Sorry. I need them to walk home in. <laughs> when was the last time I tickled the Irish? I was at a gig on uh, last Friday. I was at the, uh, in Dunedin, Florida, in one of the hotels there, in, uh, playing with my buddy uh, Jeremy, and he was a sax player, and just the two of us were uh, plunking down some jazz, you know? One of those kind of things. All right, so here we go. Let's see here. We got uh, Steve Andrews. Otherwise, Danny, for the last 20 years, I was in uh, Dubai playing every day. I had, six, I had six nights a week. I had one day off, actually. So we got 36 seconds on the old clock. Oh, we got 12. Dale Nelson comes in at 12. We'll reset the clock there for you. All right. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Johnny. I'm not that good. I just play a little bit. Have some fun, you know what I'm saying? So here we go. We got Dale Nelson, 12 bucks on the Chargers. All right. So there we go. Going once to him. 
And right now, Dale's got it going once. Right now, Dale actually controls the board right now. He's got the uh, drag truck down, too, as well. So let's see here. Dale Nelson. It's pretty cool because we got a little bit of a classics in there as well. So we got 18 on the clock. <laughs> Johnny Allen says, yeah, right. Uh, Wayne Farr is out on the Chargers. Here we go. 12, 11, 10. All right. <laughs> Take your glockenspiel lessons. All right, that's cool. All righty, here we go. And it's going to be sold. There we go. Sold, 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 Dale Nelson. You got them for 12 smackaroonies. Awesome. All right, those are pretty cool castings. I like, the, I like those Mopar ones. Those are pretty cool, especially the Charger. All right, so let's put them aside here. We'll put them over here. And then let's sell off that drag truck right now. We got right now, we got Nel Dale Nelson's on the drag truck. At, he's got $25 on it. In the meantime... All right, let's, uh, let's sell it off. Let's get her in there. So why don't we put a clock on it, as my brother says. Let's put the clock on that bad boy and give it the old 50-second clock. And there we go. And then what we've done is actually gone in there. Hey there, Jason. All right. Like I said, if anybody's new in the house, just make sure you go to Diecast TV and make sure you do register yourself there. It's an important thing to do. Hey, hey Nigel. How you doing, buddy? Mr. Quick was in last night. They had some good uh, good uh, boxing matches going on in here in the auction, that's for sure. Between Danny Maisie and uh, Nigel Quick was amazing. And I think uh, some Royal Richardson was in those things, all that kind of stuff. All right. <laughs> yeah, of course, I'm just trying to, you know me. I'm more of the laid-back type. I'm not the, uh, I'm just one of those kind of cats, you know. <laughs> that's one of those things. If I had a keyboard here, I'd play you some tunes. That's all. Actually, I do have one, but it's not set up yet. So 26, says Damien Harris on the tr truck. So it looks like we're resetting the clock. And it's been reset. <laughs> Actually, the producer Mike is uh, handling it very quickly, and he's very good. So that's good. I don't have to think too much. All right, so here we go. All right, we got 30 seconds on the clock almost right now. It's 30 seconds. There we go, 30 seconds. Let's go in once to Damien Harris. Let's see what we're saying in there. Dale, are you in or out? Let me know. It's right now we got 21 seconds. 20 seconds left on the clock. Here we go. It's going down to the wire, looks like. Damien Harris has got it. He just sniped in there for a second. And he's got it at 26. And we're waiting. We've got 9, 8, 7. Six. Now I gotta watch all these little areas here. Three, two, one. Sold, sold, sold. Damien Harris got it for 26 smackaroonies. All right, so there we go. Pull that off. And there we go. Dale, you came in a little bit late. You gotta get in a little bit earlier. You're close to getting there, but uh, no cigar on that one. That one's a little bit late. If you may, if you have a lag, try to do a loud lag test, all right? Classic red lines, not right now. I have some on the way, but I don't have any. They didn't arrive yet, actually, to be honest with you. I don't know why they don't arrive, but that's one of those things. That USPS sometimes is not so reliable. <laughs> All right, so we got this. I got a fastback now I put in the garage. I, I slipped that in there without telling you guys. But it's pretty cool. It's, uh, you know, those cool classics. Okay, so we got six. Uh, Wayne Farr jumped on their six on the V-Dub. It's pretty cool looking because it's got this uh, Spectra Frost paint. So it's almost got like a matte kind of finish on the thing. It's pretty nice. And I got a few of these uh, cool classics in front of me I was going to sell today. And let's see what we can put in the... You snooze, you lose. <laughs> it's one of those things, Dale. You snooze, you lose. You're absolutely right. So let's see what we can do with... Um... Oh, what am I going to put in there? Let's take a look here. Let's see. Uh... Yeah, Brandon, on my... Claw, on my uh... On my screen, it didn't look like that. That's the only thing. And I can only go by my screen. And that's the only problem with that. I can only tell on my screen. So we got Jeff. Look at Jeff Lang says, hi, black walls tonight. I do have some black walls. I can put some in there. Let's see what I got here. I got a Formula Fever black wall. Little Hot Wheels. Looks like pretty clean looking. Let's put one of those in there. All right. Let's put that in there. Maybe I can get the old turntable moving around. I think I got it somehow. All right. All right, so I'll put in the, the old Jeff Lang. I'll put up a black wall for you. Jeff Lang's in on the uh, YouTube side of things, and I'll, uh, he's asked for a black wall. 
black wall or our basic wheel. We put him in there. <laughs> He's got black wools. <laughs> He's in there. Gumbo! <laughs> Diamond Eddie Diaz! He's in there. <laughs> He's got 50 bucks a gallon or a black gas or PM me. <laughs> he cracked me up every time. Oh, no problem. No problem there, Delmar. I see your uh, message as well. All right, so there we go. Brandon, I got something for you too, Mr. Helmke. I've got actually something on my desk. I forgot to send out to you. I, I got them in there. There's some cars there for you. I uh, remembered I, I needed to send you something. I forgot to send it. And I have it there. I saw it today. So I'll send it out as soon as I can. So we got four on the black wall from Jeff Lang. And right now we're looking at uh, six on uh, the Spectre Frost uh, Fastback, all right? The V-Dub. And that's from Wayne Farr. And he's got six, and then we got four on the black wall. All right, there we go. So pretty cool. Here we go. Hey, you doing? Uh, Mr. Bennett is in the house. Mr. John R. <laughs> Fellow Canadian, <coughs> hopefully you're not freezing too much. I saw in Toronto last night it was minus seven. Well, uh, for the uh, American folk, that's like, what is that, 20? Something like that? Less? Maybe less? No. I don't know. I don't really know, actually, how to convert that. <laughs> but I know when it's cold here. I know when it's cold. I don't want it's cool then. Yes, yeah, Brandon. I, I I put it on my desk a long time ago, and I covered it with some stuff. And then I was like, oh my goodness, I got to get these cars out to Brandon. There were some things there I had to do there. There goes the room. Canada's in the house. All right, that's what I'm thinking about. That's the old room. I want to see all the old boys are back in the house. It's funny. All right, so Jeff Lang's got four on the black wall, and let's get this Spectre Frost V dub. So let's take a close look at this one first. I want to show you the the old V-dub there. All right, let's take a look at this. But pretty cool looking because the top is what I like about this guy. Look at this. Pretty cool looking. It's got the old 65 on there. It's got I like the fin on the back too. So let's do a little bit of the old the typical front end of that fastback. But look at this. It's pretty cool. It's got a little bit of serious exhaust on that bad boy. <laughs> oh no! Don't start the Black Hawk Nation. What's that? You're talking about, uh, you were Lightning's fan here. You know, I don't want to mention anything, but aren't they first in the league? <laughs> hold on a sec, hold on a sec. Just want to just point that out there, Mr. Danny. <laughs> when we get in the playoffs, if we ever see the Chicago Blackhawks, yeah, come on down, and we'll go up there for you. All right, so let's sell off the cool classics going once to Wayne Farr. Let's well, actually put a clock, sorry. I'm, I'm so used to my style. Let's just go on the clock. 50 seconds on the clock, as my brother says. Here we go. Boom, it's on. <laughs> All right, so we got a clock on the fastback. Pretty cool looking car, though, I have to admit. All right, so we got 40 seconds. Blackhawk Nation, that's so funny. Now I got to read that all the time now. <laughs> it's the Lightning Tribe down here. All right. And of all things, I was a Leaf fan for a long time. Right now, how much is this? It's, five, it's right now $6. It's the Wayne Farr, is on the fastback. And we got Jeff Lang's on four dollars on the uh, black wall. No, we're talking about hockey there, John. <laughs> you crack me up. <laughs> oh, you know us Canadians, we like anything on ice. <laughs> Even if football's on ice. All right, here we go. Sold, sold, sold. Way far, I got it. All right, here we are. Let's get her going here, and that's was for six bucks. He's got that fastback. Sweet deal on that one, too. All right, pretty cool. All right, so then we go back in the old uh, showroom there. We got the old black wall. All right, so let's see the old piles here. All right, in the meantime, let's put go some go-karts. I haven't done those in a while. I've got some cool go-karts. Let's start with the Series 1 go-kart. Let's do that classic go-kart. And, of course, then I'll show you each one as we go. Oh, Rangers fans in the house. All right, here we go. What's hockey, Aaron says. <laughs> How you doing, Aaron? I haven't seen you in a while. Aaron Scott, if anybody knows, he's got the biggest, I'm telling you right now, the biggest uh, gasser uh, set I've seen. <laughs> Works dead again. All right, Dennis, I know what that means. <laughs> Dennis Barr. He's also from Australia. There you go. Oh, we got some, oh, we got, <laughs> Mike's a Knicks fan, so if you see something about the Knicks, that's his doing. <laughs> Three on the carts, hold on a second, I'm not finished with the carts yet, I'm gonna, but you put some bids on there, and then, you know, we gotta get her going here, we got Wayne Forrest's three, 
So I got the summer racing cart, which is pretty cool, the yellow one. They did like this series, I think they made like, I think there was like eight car series they made like that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Johnny on. That's right, I think that's called croquet. No, it's not on horses. What's, it, what's that thing called? What's that called? Oh, they played it in Dubai all the time. In fact, I played, I played a gig at one of those places. Shake was on the old horse there. And then, uh, he, and then he, he got smacked off. Somebody hit him when they got off. And he was like, oh, apologetic. He's like, no, no, it's okay. It's part of the game, man. What to do? What's a gazard? It's a Ford gasser. Don't forget comments are, you know, don't forget. <laughs> All right, so let's see here. All right, so let's do one more thing here. All right, so we got three go-karts. I'm going to put in there a little trio of go-karts. In the meantime, let's go over to flip over to the uh, black wall. We'll take a close look at the, the black wall quickly. That's there. It's pretty clean looking. Right now, it's four bucks on Jeff Lang. He likes those black walls, and I'll put up a few more black walls I have here. Dale says five on the cards. Gilbert also says four on the go-karts, but right now, five. So we got Wayne Forrest. He jumps in at 10. He's seen the three of them. It's pretty cool. So here we go. We got Ed Robert Lewis came in at eight a little bit late. Wayne Forrest already had the $10 bid before he got it in there. But I do appreciate it, Robert. It's, it's nice to see you in the house. I've been... Uh, I've been the one putting the stickers on, uh, you know, the labels, the shipping labels on your uh, boxes. And we got the box, the packing crew is in the house, which is really appreciated. They're really great at it. 15 says Dale Nelson on the carts. Thank you. Okay, so we got the carts going on. All right. That's a good idea, Dennis, because <laughs> I got so many uh, different ones here. I have no idea what you need. All right, so here we go. Let's do this one. Wayne Farr says 16 on the go-karts. So it looks like we're selling the go-karts. <laughs> then we'll go back to the black wall. I know, Jeff, I think you've got that black wall anyway in the bag. So here we go. Put 50 seconds on the go-karts right now. Let's get that rolling here. And there we go. And then I, I found a cool color shifter. We'll put that up in a minute. All right. <laughs> All right. Hey, Robert, how you doing? Hey, Dale Nelson says 18 on the carts. They are pretty cool. Good job on the packing, Robert Lewis says. Thank you very much. Uh, I hope they hear that. I hope they see that. It's pretty cool. I was going to approach my brother. Maybe we can put these screens on the screen. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right. So, Dale Nelson, look at that. It, Wayne is being a gentleman. He's letting it go. He's, uh, yeah, he's bowing out to you. So, that's pretty cool. All right. We got 23 seconds. <laughs> All right, we're down to 15, 16, 15. There we go. The go-karts are going to go. Those aren't easy to find. I know I, I only come across go-karts once in a while. It's not, either that or people like to keep them. Jorge Pahua says, yo, 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 by the way. I missed that. <laughs> Mike and Amy's in the house. All right, here we go. Sold, sold, sold. The go-karts are sold. And it's Dale Nelson. Good job. Dale Nelson. Let me just write out the paperwork here, first of all. And it was for 18 on the go-karts. All right, very cool. All right, so. Uh, see, that's what you have. That's right. It went to the office because we do the shipping from the PayPal. <laughs> Don't forget. All right, the black wall is going to go now. Here we go. Let it roll here. Going once. All right. Let's just put these over here. Put them over here. All right, so going once. It's Jeff Lang, sorry about the way he's waiting here. Oh, he's been patiently waiting so I can sell off the black wall. So in the meantime, I will sell off the black wall. Okay. So what we'll do, it's going once. Let's put the clock on the black wall. Might as well. I'll get her going there. All right. All right. So and I put some stuff in the garage, but it's got to it's got to start there. We got to start at least the bidding in in the garage stuff at ten dollars. Okay. So we got to do that. Any semis? Not yet. Wayne, I've been looking for some good semis to come in. Uh, I'm trying to get some, you know, decent ones. I'm also a collector of them, too. I like, I, I fell in love with them, actually. I do have some black walls semis coming, though. I have to do that. Oh, Jorge, you want some more? Go. <laughs> I just finished telling you. I don't come across with that that much. <laughs> now you want me to put another setup. Oh, my. Here we go, you guys. Ten seconds left on the black wall. Here we go. Jeff Lang's going once, going twice. I think we timed her down. He's got it for four bucks. That's a good deal, actually. Nice, clean black wall. All right, it's sold, sold, sold. There we go. Pretty cool looking. That's actually in pretty good shape, that one. All right, all right. Good job. Nice buy there, Jeff. All right. 
All right. In the meantime, in this garage, I have two Firebirds. Now, it's got to start at 10 bucks in the garage, please. All right. <laughs> you kill me. All right. So there we go. The go-karts actually have a name or just called go-karts. It actually says go-karts on them. <laughs> like the Indies. All right, cool. Richard Flem's in the house. All right, everybody's sort of joining in right now. That's pretty cool. I like it. And some funny cars. Now, you know, you want Blackwell funny cars or do you want like, you know, because I have these Hot Wheels classic funny cars. I've got, actually, I got tons of them. He says, gee, Richard Flem says, peace. All right, I do like Indy cars too. My pocket car's an Indy car. Well, let me see what I can do with it in the meantime. So Brandon... Oh, so the, right now, <clears throat> uh, Wayne Farr says 12 bucks on the Firebirds. Brandon, you came a little bit late after the Far anyway. was a little bit less, too, as well. So we got the bidding starting at 12 bucks. I love What I love about this one is this Pontiac, the 67 Pontiac Firebird in the cool classics. That purple is killer. When you see it in your hands, it's amazing. So right now, we got Wayne Farr at 15 on the Firebirds. Yeah. 15 on the Camaro. Dale, wake up. <laughs> the Wicker Barrel. I'm looking at it. Although they, you know what, I mix. I make that mistake all the time. But I'll tell you what I'll do. I may. I'll tell. <laughs> just to go on here. Let's put up. Uh, oh, let me see. Indy cars. I have. Should I put this one in there? Let me just see what I got. I want to put some in there. Hey, I saw your brother's Porsche. No, I can't do that. He almost sold my comb beyond me, and that wasn't supposed to be for sale. So that's okay. I won't do that to him. <laughs> I'm nicer than that. All right. Let me see what we got here. Something new. Something I want to put in something in the showroom here. There's a black wall camper, but this is cool. I'm not sure. 18 on the Firebirds. Thank you. From Dale. I got a little black wall. <clears throat> I put this up before, but I think it's cool, and I think it should sell. This one's a grease. This is a grease gremlin, and I like the grease gremlin because it's kind of cool looking. It's almost one of those uh, sprint kind of cars, that kind of stuff. So on um, both parking. You guys are crazy. Rob Sean, you're jumping back and forth from YouTube and, and Facebook. You guys do that all the time, but I like it. It's pretty cool. And the rest of everything, we'll just sell everything. <laughs> Wayne Forrest says 20 bucks on the Firebirds. Okay, 20 bucks on the Firebirds. Okay, that's where we're at. And we got a little black wall uh, gr greased gremlin. <laughs> Fryer chickens. Fryer chickens. 22 says Brandon Hemkelke on the, on the Firebirds right now. 25 on the Firebirds, says Dalton Dale Nelson. Oh, we got a little bit of action going on here. But that, I'm telling you, that Grease Gremlin is clean. And I, I know Jeff, yeah, so you would appreciate it. I figured you weren't in the other day when I put them up there. So uh, keep me on my toes. Yeah, but this, you know how confusing this is, Rob? <laughs> Just to check. By the way, I spoke to Rob on the phone. <laughs> I think I got to speak to him at least. And it's so funny when I speak to you guys on the phone. Like, I don't know what you guys sound like. I only can read the, your words, but... You guys are just like the words you're putting up there. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, let's put a clock on the Firebirds. Let's get it going here, as my brother says. Get him out of here. All right, so let's put up their 50-second clock. Hammer it away. All right, so we got a couple cool classic, a little couple classics, cool and regular. <laughs> Dale, look at that. Being all being in there. All right, that's cool. The grease. I'm telling you, I love, <laughs> I love that one, Royal Richardson. Seriously. All right, there we go. No, it's all good. I like, what I like about this room is we're all polite. We're all positive. We want positive stuff. And that's important to us. I just want to positive and share the love, share the love and share the collecting. A lot of folks have become friends here on this on the on our from our Facebook, which is awesome, which is we really, really what we like. All right, so right now we got 30 seconds on the clock. Don't forget. By the way, I also bought a bunch of tre super treasure hunts. I bought. Uh, by the way, just recently, just to give you the inside scoop, 22 seconds left. By the way, um, on the uh, Firebirds. And it looks like it's going to Mr. Dale Nelson. All right, so it's going once, and now it's going twice, of course, and we've got 10 seconds left. I bought, uh, I think it's 37 treasure hunts, super treasure hunts, and I bought the entire 2007 set of treasure. So the, just mull that over for a bit. And it's sold, sold, sold to Dale Nelson. He had them for, I believe it was 25. Let me just double check that. So I think so. I'm just going to get the. Uh, my producer just, yep, he did. That's right. I thought so. Sold, 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 as I like to say. Pretty wicked. Yep, on the black wall, we got the five on the greased. Oh, this is pretty wicked. These five. I'm telling you, that purple one you have in your hands, you'll love it. It's pretty cool. All right. All 
right? So we're working a little just a duo here as on the on the on the gear here. So that's cool. So I'm gonna put up. This is a pretty cool. You guys were talking about Camaro, so I'll put up a little bit of color shifting Camaro as well. So right now Jeff Lang's got the black wall for five bucks. It's a really nice, clean one. I love the roll cage in this. This is really like that. When I was a kid, man, I had all kinds of this stuff. So it's pretty cool. And uh, I got to play with my brother's uh, red lines. And, of course, I grew up when the black walls came out. So it's pretty cool. Classic pack number four. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Dennis. I, mean, I, I, I need to know this information before I get here. <laughs> but I'll look for it for next time. All right, Jeff, Mr. Lang. Right now, Mr. Jeff Lang has got the... Black wall. Now this one I put in there, 67 Camaro. It's one of these color shifting ones. I thought I had I had some that were uh, loose, like the black walls color shifters, which are pretty cool. And I thought, ah, I'll put it up there. You guys were talking about uh, different kind of cars and Camaros and stuff, so I thought I'd put it up there. So that's pretty cool. I do have a set of Vets too. So if anybody's into Vets, I'm going to put that in the garage in a minute. Four on Wayne Farr on the Camaro. Thank you very much. So we got Jeff Lang. Let's take a look at that black wall and let's get that sold while we're there. Mark Napier's in the house. All right, hey, Mike. Uh, Mark, how you doing, buddy? It's awesome. I like everybody's joining in. It's pretty cool. Uh, I like it when we get a lot of a lot of folks in here. <laughs> I'll try, Dennis. I'll try to go on the fly looking for you, but you know how it is here. All right, so we got 50 seconds on the clock. We're going to start it now on the Grease Gremlin. <laughs> grease Gremlin. They used to soup up those Gremlins so bad. I remember my brother coming home one time. And he was trying to get, he's got his, you know, he's getting his muscle car on. So he had a Vega, I think it was. And, uh, oh my goodness, he had some crazy engine in it. I think my, my mom and dad went crazy. <laughs> no, you can't, you're going to kill yourself with that thing. It's funny. That's aside from all the Beatles that he used to have. I used to remember, I was a kid, I was jumping in his Beetle trying to drive it. All right, so here we go. Jeff Lang on the black wall, going once. He's got five bucks on that one right now. Hey, Mr. Russell Kemp is in the house. All right, that's pretty cool. Oh, six. Richard Flam says six on the Gremlin. Oh, you got a little bit of competition there, Mr. Lang. We got to restart the clock. It's restart the clock. I'm telling you, my producer's on top of it because by the time I looked up, it already had 46 seconds on it. <laughs> Gene Height says five on the Camaro, so that's good. Got to make a mental note. Gene Height's on the Camaro. Got it, five. All right, so here we go. We got Right now, we got Richard Flam came in at six dollars on the Gremlin, Jeff. Just so you know, he's in the Facebook. Now, Jeff Lang just jumped on it at $7 on the YouTube side of things. So we'll reset the clock, and there we go, and that's where we're at right now. Wayne Farr, by the way, has jumped on the Camaro for 6 bucks. So we'll keep that in mind. Right now, we're looking at the black wall. It's being sold off. We've got 40 seconds left on that one, and right now, Jeff Lang has that Gremlin for $7 right now. He's on YouTube right now on the YouTube side of things. All right, so here we go. I have to get used to these two sides of things. It's like a two-sided coin. i got to watch. Now, Richard Flem says $8, and I believe that's on the Gremlin. So right now, Richard Flem has it on Facebook on $8 on the Gremlin. All right, just so we know. All right, so let's get back in there. $8. So the clock has been reset, and it's already got 10 seconds off of it. Because by the time I looked up, <laughs> it's already gone down. All right, so I'm, I'll be working on it. I'll be working on it there, Dennis. Don't worry. I'll see what I get. <laughs> you never, never, ever annoying. Nobody's, nobody's ever annoying unless they're mean. That's the only time when people are annoying. That's the only time I get annoyed. Jeff Lang says nine on the black wall. Thank you very much. Reset the clock. There we go. Reset the clock. All right. There we go. All right. So there we go. We're back on it now. We got Jeff Lang has nine dollars on the gremlin right now. Richard, what say you? Let me say. Let me get some quotations of my brother. What say you? <laughs> and I probably sound like him too, don't I? I just don't look like him. That's why I grew the old, uh, the old goatee. Bradley Red live from Korea. That's right. I was just packed a couple boxes for him. Actually, just the guy over there. Retro Flame says he's out. Looks like you're going down there, Jeff Lang. You're taking it to the wire now. Going once. All right. So the last on the black wall is at nine dollars. So anybody else wants to take in? If not, it's got ten seconds left on the clock. <laughs> And there we go. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. It looks like it's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. That Grease Gremlin. Pretty cool looking car, too. Pretty wicked, too. Always uh, the memories of childhood comes back on me on this one. All right, cool. All right, in the meantime, we got in there. We got the old color shifter. That was at $5, I believe. Mr. Height, Gene Height, is on that one. And that's where that, that's my memory for you. Can you imagine? I actually memorized that. I remember that. <laughs> 
All right, so let me see what else we got in here. All right, we got a Solaire. This is one of the ultra hot wheels. All right, we'll see. Maybe I'll put that up. I'm not sure. I know you like Indy cars. Let's see what I can do. Anyway, in the meantime, let's just go on the Camaro. Camaro right now is what's what we got cooking. And we'll go from there. Let's see if I got. What's this one? Let me see what this one. I think I think I see what this is, but flat out. Four four two flat out. <laughs> Look at this black wall. All right, let's do this one. Let's put this black wall. Wayne Farr says six on the Camaro. Sorry about that. I must have missed it. Mr. Michael Schmucker, I need you to. Uh, <laughs> to uh, all right, all right. There we go. Actually, people have mistaken me already because they're trying to see on YouTube. They think I'm my brother. <laughs> That's not me. <laughs> That's all right. I like that. So right now, Mr. Michael Schmucker, I haven't. Uh, I needed you to register on DieCastTV.com. It's kind of important. If if I have registered, let me know what your um, your username is because I can't find you. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Wayne for six dollars on the Camaro right now. And we have four dollars on the black wall that's in the showroom. That's where we're at. Okay. That's pretty cool. Alright, so here we go. There's a G body. That's there you go, Robert. I forgot that about G bodies. You like those things. I had a few uh, few kicking around too for you, Robert. So in the meantime, we got six on the Camaro. Let's sell off the old color shifter. Yeah, it's got that. Did you pull it out there or something? Yeah, I did. <laughs> it's got the old color shifting. Color shifting. Water changes the color. All right. There's Robert. Nice to see you in the house there, Robert. Hope everything's cool in the house. All right, that 442. I was looking at that one. There you go. Okay, here we go. So here we go. We got this one. We're looking at the Camaro. Let's sell. Put a clock on this one. 50 seconds. There we go. We got right now 50 seconds, and that's on with Wayne Farr right now at the 6 six uh, o'clock. $6 on the Camaro. All right. So if you're not registered, please register at DieCastTV.com. It's important. So we know how to bill you and how where to send stuff and all that kind of stuff. It's kind of important. All right. There we go. We'll go from there. Camaro in the house and the color shifter. Let's sell that thing off. All right. So right now we're at $6 on Wayne Farr. And we got 20 seconds left. I'm just doing the paperwork now. All righty. Looks like we're going once. Going twice to Wayne Farr on the Camaro. All righty. Here we go. Three, two, one. And it's sold, sold, sold. You got it there, Wayne. Six smackaroonies. There you go. That little color shifter. And we're back on the black wall, the 442. And it's got, uh, it's deceived me that 442. That's pretty cool. Though. All right, so that's where we go. That's right, uh, Wayne, you got that sold, sold, sold. You got them there. That's pretty cool. So in the meantime, I'll just, uh, you know, have my, we'll just do some things here. Let's just keep going on the 442. Let's get the thing sold off. So let's get the 50 second clock on that. Oh, you gave away. You gave away my garage. I was trying to be sneaky. <laughs> so, all right, so let's go back into the showroom. Let's get a clock on that. And let's get her going here. All right, so here we go. <clears throat> let's get the clock going, 50 seconds. We got Jeff Lang on that uh, 442. All righty. I wonder if I have any more of them G-bodies kicking around. I do have one of those original. Oh, let me see if I can put this one down. Color shifters. All right, so we got 30 seconds, Jeff Lang. All right, pretty cool. All right. All right, it's down now to 18 seconds. Jeff Lang is on there. I don't know who Carmine is, but she thinks or she thinks or he thinks I'm my brother. <laughs> so there we go. Jeff Lang, here we go. Going once. <clears throat> going twice. 
All right, and it looks like it's sold, sold, sold. Jeff, you got it. What an easy, nice steal that one. Four bucks you got that one. Steal on that. Cool. Good job. All right, pretty nice looking uh, black wall there. All right, cool. In the meantime, we got uh, this little Spectre Frost painted fella in the old garage. Let me just make sure it's in the, uh, yeah, I'll put it over a bit for you. All right, there you go. Pretty cool little gangster looking. <laughs> kind of low rider kind of vibe. And what I'll do is, uh, let's see here what we got in here. Let's put this one in here. A little bit of a, is it IndyCar? What is this one? I forget what this one's called. I forget what this one's called. If you guys can help me out, help me out. <laughs> Five on the Hornets. Okay, but first, Wayne Farr came in on the Classic right now. And he got in just a little bit ahead of you there, Damien. Pretty cool. I'll show you the whole car on that one, that cool Classic. It's pretty cool looking. And I got a little bit of, uh, yeah, a little bit of open wheel uh, on, that, on that Indy car there. It's pretty cool looking. All right, open wheels. I like the open wheel racing. It's fast. <laughs> All right, look at it. Hey, Mr. Derek Garcia is in the house from the old west side. <laughs> We're on the east side. He's on the west side. All right, one time we'll eventually meet somewhere in the middle. All right, so Wayne Farr is on the Spectra Frost uh, paint. That's a pretty cool looking car. Cool classics. Let me take a look. There was like a set of five of these things. I had the Purple Passion, the Pickup, the 29 Pickup. You know, that, that I think it's a gold one. And then there's a 69 Camaro in this set. There's, this one's the 52 Hudson, of course. And then there's a 68 Olds 442 that came with this five sets. So it's pretty cool looking. Let's take a look at this one closely. Oh, I, I don't have that one, I don't think, there, David. I, if I if you know, find one for me. I'd love one. So that's pretty cool. Look at that. We got seven. Dale Nelson just came in. Wayne Farr said eight on that classic. Take a look at this. Got the front and the back. I like the lines on this one. That's a pimp and ride is what I like to call them. All right, so right now we got eight on the classic from Wayne Farr. And that's where we're holding right now. I got something else on there. I got another cool classic, and then I'll get some other things going on. In the meantime, eight on the classic Wayne Farr, and I got a little black wall on the showroom. All right. 510 in the back is nice. Okay, I can put that up there, Wayne. Which one's this one? Like this one? Oh, yeah, this is nice. Okay, hold on a sec here. All right, let's put, we can put that up in a minute. Nine says on the classic Dale Nelson. Thank you, Dale. Appreciate that. Wayne Farr says 10 on the classic. All right, there we go. A little bit of a <laughs> boxing match. Left hook, right hook, boom, boom. Combinations. There you go. And what I can do with the black wall. Is it getting anything? Is that, Jeff, did you put that up there after or was that for the other one? I think that was the one before, wasn't it? Yeah, but I think that was from uh, the 442. All right, so we got 10 on the classic right now. And Wayne Farr's got it. Ah, uh, you do. Good job. Yeah, good eyes. He's got a black. I do have a black wall camper in the back. You want me to put that up? I can put it up there. It's not too bad. It's got a little bit of wear on the side of it, but I can do that. I can swap out those black walls. Oops, one on the black wall. <laughs> That's it. Jeff says one on the black wall. I know it's a little bit played with that one. <laughs> it's a loved one. Let's put it that way. Wayne, now, nah, see, Dale's, uh, since you let him have some, Dale's doing the other way around. He's doing it for you. So let's put a, cl let's put a clock on the old cool classics. And we got 50-second clock on that one. Let's see. And I'll put up there. Hey, hey, Rick. My fellow muso, musicians. He's a drummer, too. I'd like to see him play. All right, let's get that clock rolling there. There we go. All right, so we got right now, we got Wayne Farr, $10 on the classic. He's got that classic Hornet, 52 Hornet, Hudson Hornet. I like the super of that one, that super trans hunt we had. It's pretty nice looking, too. So Jeff Lang, meantime, has a $1 bid on the old uh, token one <laughs> on the Indy card. Yo, Jeff, what car is that one called? What's the name of that thing? I keep It's bugging me now. It's on the tip of my tongue, and I can't remember it. All right, 67 Camels. You know, I just had a I had a color shifter one just, just now, Rick. Just put it up. You just missed it. What else do I got here? I got a little bluebird. All right, in the meantime, 
Sorry about that, Rick. If I can find some on the fly here, I'll try to put, put them in there for you. All right, so there we go. Or drumsticks. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sold, sold, sold. I got Jack. I'm talking to Rick. Look, and there we go. We sold it off, Wayne. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's what happens. I like the clock because it pushes me along, doesn't it? <laughs> I got nowhere to hide. $10 for Wayne on that classic. It's sold. All right, there we go. In the meantime, we flipped over into the garage, or rather the showroom there. All right, I was trying to think about 67 Camaros that I have right with me. I don't have too many right next to me, but all right. In the meantime, also, what do we got here? Let's see. We got one there. I'm going to do one more cool classic, and then we'll put up that uh, JDM for you. Okay, cool classic. This is pretty cool. It's a 65 Ford Galaxy. So I thought I'd mix up the old brands there. We'll put that in there as well. And no hiding. That's right. There's no hiding, Rob. There's no hiding. Unless you're bidding. <laughs> and then you don't want the clock. <laughs> and you like my style. All right. There we go. All right. So we do have a camper, which I'll put up too in the black wall as well. So here we go. Let's sell. Let's sell off. Let me put this in proper view. Sorry about that. My, my aiming is not so good. <laughs> All right, so we got a cool classic, and uh, don't forget to put that there, Damien. We got also a black wall in the show in the showroom there, and it's for Buck. So here we go. Might as well get in there. Let's sell off the it's for Jeff Lang. He's been in there. He's been buying on the up. No problem. There we go. It's pretty cool. All right, so there we go. Hold on a sec here. We got four on the galaxies. Hold on, but I think Damien Harris had the original four there, Rick. So if we want to get that going, we got to get it up to five. It's cool. In the meantime, the black wall in the showroom. Let's put the clock on it, hit it on, and let's ready to roll. So we got right now we got Jeff Lang. He's the collector of the. I should just put up all the black walls, and then Jeff, you just buy them all. <laughs> Actually, there's although some people are in there. So Rick Appleton came in at five on the Galaxy, I believe. I think that's what's going on there on the classic eight on the on the. Oh, there, John R. Bennett is on YouTube putting five on it, but it's now eight dollars because Wayne Farr has jumped up on the Facebook side of things and said eight dollars for the classic. And that's right, the purple thing, the yellow dots in the backyard. I'll see what I'm what you're looking at. Jeff Lang in the meantime has that one, and no, Dale Nelson has just come in on the cool classics at ten dollars. Just so you know. <laughs> you guys are they're all they're all gang uh, teaming up on the uh, YouTube side of things. Thanks guys All right, the packing guys are going home for the evening. That's good stuff. Thank you guys good stuff All right, so here we are Levin says Rickle Appleton. All right, and but we're sold on the Indy car for Jeff Lang first Let's get that out the door sold sold sold. Oh I got to keep on my toes over here. What's going on Rick Appleton's got 11. All right. So far, so good. So there we go. Rick Appleton's got 11 on that. 15 says Dale Nelson on that classic. And it's a beaut. All right, there you go. <laughs> there you go. There are yours. Yeah, look at that. Everybody's, that's pretty nice. Let's uh, take a close look at it. I know I didn't get to show, so to show it off a bit. But I like this because I get to see it nice and close up too. And you get the, so the back end, the front end of it, pretty cool. The bottom side, pretty nice. All right, so looks like it's going to be sold. Let's put a clock on it right away. All right, now let's get something for the old showroom in the meantime. All right, so. All right, so we'll try to get her going back and forth. I'll try to keep this rolling like this. So we get the clock going up. Yeah, it's cool. Let's get it rolling here. And there we are. Pretty cool. 15's got Dale Nelson on the clock on the classic right now. Everybody's sort of handed it to him right now, which is cool. I just did the, I do the clock just as, a, you know, one of those things. <laughs> just to make it official, as they say. All right, so Dale, you get the paperwork. I'm writing your name now. It's going once to you. All right. Aha, see, there we go. We got a sniper in the house. Richard Flynn came in at 17. Start the clock. He's got it back on the clock, a new clock. See, the producer's faster than I am. I'm much slower. I'm laid back. This is, like, this is getting tense with these clocks. <laughs> Who's making all this stress? I want stress-free environment. <laughs> Oh, the only stress I have is the USPS guy, the post office. <laughs> Man, he didn't pick up you. Yesterday, he didn't pick up the stuff. He, he left some stuff on the shelf. I don't know why. I was so angry. I was ready to rip his head off. I didn't speak to him today. Oh, but he took everything today. Thank goodness. So we got 14. 18 says Dale Nelson on the classic. Restart that clock. Restart that clock. Dale Nelson's paperwork is still in front of me. So there we go. Well, I might as well use it. We'll keep it going here. All right, let's get it rolling here. 
I think he meant 19. I don't think you want to jump up to 29, I don't think. Yeah, so we it's 19, I believe. Yes, all right. From Richard Flem, restart the clock. Restart the clock. There we go. Richard Flem's on 19 on that cool classic. These cool classics are wicked. That's all I got to say. And this one's, one's part of that, uh, oh, the one with the fox body. Oh, yeah, and the drag beetle. Oh, yeah, 20 on the classic. This is pretty cool. Far Out Galaxy. I like that. I like that. It's pretty wicked looking. All right, 20 on the glass. Dale, 20, 25, says Richard Flynn. He wants this thing. He ain't letting it go. Oh, oh, we have a little bit of a boxing match here. We have an auction. That's the way we like that one. Wow. Richard Flynn slams down a 25-er. Woo! I'm selling to my brother now. <laughs> what is that? Well, first of all, what's that about? <laughs> all right, Richard Flem, 30 seconds on the clock. Dale says he's out. Oh, he got that was a finishing blow, I think. That one's a hard one. That was right in there in the chops. Oh, <laughs> Richard Flem says goodbye. <laughs> That's, oh, my goodness. Wow. That was a smack. That was a smackdown as uh, the streets would be in here. It'd be like, oh, it's all smackdown. <laughs> All right, so there we go. We got 25 bucks. Richard Flem, wow. Woo. And it's gone. It's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. I don't think you're going to touch that one. <laughs> Dang, that was a good one. Rich Flem, that was amazing. You got that one. That bit, He slammed that bad boy down. All right, so let's go. We got a little camper action in the other side, in the black wall. Camper is in. Woo. Goom. Boom. <laughs> wow, look at that. That was a good little, uh, little, little, little. Got my adrenaline going there for a second there. Holy macaronis. All right. Thank you there, guys. Appreciate that. So right now we got a little camper black wall in the uh, left side of me, or the actually the showroom. And then in the meantime, I promised you guys this JDM. Now this one's a 1973 Datsun 510 wide body. And this, uh, this JDM tuners is really cool. I want you guys to get in there. Let's at least start the bidding on this one at five bucks and then let's go from there, okay? Let's do that, okay? David Wee says a buck on the camper. <laughs> Three on the camper, Wayne Farr, okay? Got a little bit of action going on there, Wayne Farr, in the Facebook side of things. What's the purple thing? I'm going to see what's going on purple with the yellow. Um, in the backyard here, you're talking about dots. I don't know yet now. Oh, I see what, I see what you're doing. I see what you're saying, okay. Five on the JDM, thank you, says Damien Harris. And we got three on the camper from Mr. Farr. I got, I've got the dots one in my hand. It is also a black wall. I can't remember the name of this one, though. I don't know. I'll put it in there anyway in the meantime. Eight on the Datsun right now. <clears throat> Wayne Farr's got eight on the Datsun, thank you. All right, there we go. All right, the purple thing, <laughs> the yellow in the backyard. Okay, I got it here. I'll put it up the, on the uh, block there in a minute there. Once we sell off the camper, there we go. So, uh, yeah, that's what that is, David. <laughs> that's that's this year's mail-in. I'm just saying there, David Weiss. I know. It's funny, David Weiss said, no, no, he won't. He, he's, he wants to bid a little bit less, but no, he's, I'm tempting him too much. I told you I got 29. I'm telling you right now, 29 drag buses, drag trucks coming in. Mostly drag buses. And they're coming in, and uh, hopefully they'll be here on Saturday. So maybe Sunday I'll have them all up. So if you guys know anybody collecting drag buses, drag trucks, please do tune in. All right, look at this. These guys are all nice. Look at these guys. All, I love that gentlemanly, gentlemanly behavior. All right, so Wayne, as far as God, let's put a clock on the... Uh, Datsun right now. Let's put the clock on the Datsun in the meantime. All right. Need a hearse. Okay, we'll see what we got in the hearse. That almost looks like a hearse. <laughs> that camper. It's an oddball, isn't it? All right. <clears throat> I'm going to go away broke. <laughs> what can I do? It's one of those things. How do you work hard? Just go broke. <laughs> Keep working harder. <laughs> That's the way that works. Oh, I'm a musician. How do you think I feel? All right, so there we go. <clears throat> Yeah, I might as well start off. <coughs> <coughs> Meantime. All right. <coughs> Sorry about that. I've got a frog in my throat, of all things. 
It's uh, chirping away. We got 35 seconds left, and so Wayne Farr's got this one. All right, and he's got it on the. Um, we're looking at the Datsun right now. <laughs> hey, wow. You're not always a gentleman. Sometimes you can be. Yeah, no problem. I understand that. All right, so we're going to go. It's going to be sold. 15 seconds. Mr. Farr. <clears throat> he's got it for eight on the Datsun. Pretty cool casting, though, I have to admit. I like it. Pretty awesome. Five, four, three. Going once, going twice. Sold, sold, sold. He's got it. He's got the JDM tuner. Eight bucks. Nice deal. <clears throat> All right, so put that over here. In the meantime, <clears throat> what else do I got? I got the, oh yeah, we're in the, right now we also have the, the showroom. <clears throat> right now the camper is at $3, I believe. And that was with Mr. Farr, I think. Let me just double check with the producer in the back, Mr. Mike. Three on the camper. There we go. So that's where we are with the camper right now. Three dollars on the camper. Let's put, uh, what was the last thing I had in the old showroom there? I had the JDM, so let's put some of these. Okay, so this one, all right, let's get that sold off. In the meantime, I'm going to set up my showroom i'm gonna do something interesting i'm gonna have a minimum start bid so we have to you have to deal with that but that's okay <clears throat> i know i need to if i'm not on on a while and your voice doesn't get to you know tuned in we'll let uh we'll do this in a minute there don't go to that shot yet let's go to the keep the showroom and sell it sell it off <clears throat> muscle machines i'm i've been looking for you ever since i know you like them there wayne i've been looking for them i haven't got some i haven't got them in yet but i've been searching Hold on, wait, wait. I gotta start 15 on the classics. So that's where that's 15. If you want to get on the classics, it's 15. There's three vets in there, but I was trying to surprise you guys. And uh it's one of those things. I'm gonna try. I was trying to do that. Brandon Helmke says 15 on the classics. Thank you. So in the meantime, let's sell off the camper first. Because I want to do it like that, kind of go that way. All right. <clears throat> and anytime you guys ask for something, don't and if I haven't got it yet, don't worry about I'm trying, I really try to work it out. It takes a while before we find stuff. It's not always easy. It's not always in my collection, so I actually have to, uh, I have to go buy stuff. <laughs> it's one of those things. Okay. In the meantime, campers at three. Wayne Farr has got it. Put the clocks already on it to 26 seconds, 25 down there. And right now, Royal Richard says says 17 on the classic. So we'll hold that thought. In the meantime, there, Mr. Royal, Mr. King, <laughs> King Richardson's in. What well, Dale says 20 on the classics. Oh my goodness, we got some, we got some bidding on the classic. <laughs> That's all right. Here we go. Oh, all right, there's a guy here. All right, check on in there, uh, Mr. Weiss, oh, for me. All right, the camper's going, and it's sold, 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 Wayne Farr. All right, he got that black wall for three bucks. That's a steal, too, but that's nice to clean that one. All right, in the meantime, let's take a look at the classics. And I found that Dale uh, Nelson came in on the classics with 20 bucks, and that's where that's sitting right now. All right, so let's do that. <clears throat> so, yeah. All right, so we got uh, we got Dale Nelson came in first on the classics after uh, Roll Richardson to put a 17 down. Dale Nelson came at 20, and then they came up from there. So that was all there. <clears throat> okay, you got to tell me. Oh yeah, show me pictures and all that kind of stuff. See what we can do, Mr. Weiss. You can also private message me that kind of stuff. In the meantime, I'll put this one on. We'll just uh, leave right now. We'll just look at the vets right now. We'll sell those off. <laughs> 25 right now, Brandon Helmke says, for the three vets that I have in there. I figured it's good. At least you get one shot. You get all the color. One, not all, but a few of the color combination, the colors in the one. So it's, uh, there we go. Super Vans he's looking for. Okay, we'll see what I can do. All right. I got 30 on the classics from Dale Nelson right now. That's the way to bid, too. He's got, Dale's got the right idea. Come in, come in strong. And that way, just in case somebody comes in behind you, they you already jumped ahead of them. So right now, Dale Nelson's got it for 30 bucks on the three classics. All right, let's get that rolling there. 30 bucks on the three classics. Right now, Dale Nelson, what we can do is put up a clock. Let's get it rolling. All right, there we go. And there we are. Out on the classics, uh, go get them, on. <laughs> get them, Dale. He's in there. He's rooting you on there. Wayne's rooting you on. All right, so in the meantime, I put in the uh, on the other side of things, uh, just a quick flash. We can take a look at the showroom there. It's that purple one with the yellow dots. I don't know what it's called, but there you go. So right now we got 30 seconds on the vets. All right. So right now, 
Here we go. 35 says Brandon. <laughs> he's, the guys are playing this game now. Brandon Helmke says 35 bucks on the classics. All three you get for this one. And they're cool. They got the cool colors in those ones. All right, so we got a new clock up there. It's at 35 right now. Here we go. That's a, yeah, there's a little bit of a bomb dropping by Mr. <laughs> Mr. Helmke. He came in dropping a bomb. $40, Dale Nelson on the classics. Wow. All right, there you go. You get all three of them. So that's the beauty of that one. All right, so here we go. Oh, my. Here we go. Dale, they got some challenging times. Now, I get it's almost to the point where it doesn't matter what the cars are. <laughs> it's who wants to win. <laughs> it's tango time. Dun, 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 dun. That's right. It's the tango music comes on. 25, 24 seconds left. Here we go. It's Dale Nelson has got it. He's got the paperwork. Going once to Dale. Whew. Uh, no, there's some boxing going on once it happens. Well, because more people are in here, more people want stuff. It's the way it works, I think. I think that's how Barrett Jackson works. <laughs> there we go. It's going to go. Sold, sold, sold. All right, all right. Here we go. All right. So, you just got on here. Anthony, if you're new, all you got to do is uh, register at diecasttv.com. And then uh, that's, so that's where you put in your PayPal information and your... Uh, email and all that kind of stuff so we know where you live and all that so where we know sounds to send stuff <laughs> so there we go so that was sold 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 on the vets and dale nelson that's a nice one that's right that's the way that one works okay so that was anybody can tell me what that is that that purple car i couldn't i couldn't can't find it's a black wall but i can't figure out what it is and where it came from it seems to me it came out of some special set but i can't remember now I need David Weiss on this one, or I need Schroffer, or any of those, or Jeff Lang. If you know, let me know what this one is. Kind of quirky. He's got that that mirrored, the mirrored uh, glass. <laughs> and there, you go. it looks like a, yeah, it looks like a Ford Aerostar to me. I was just gonna say it looks like one of those Aerostars, but you don't know the name of this one there or where it came from. That's that's what I'm trying to find out. What the heck is it? <laughs> Sometimes we play. What the heck is it? <laughs> All right, so let's see. Oh, I can complete you guys. I can tease you guys with sets and stuff. But let's do. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right, what do we got here? Lunchtime now. Half an hour to buy. He says half an hour to buy, and I forget what you're looking for now. Hold on a sec. Let's see what you're looking for. I can't remember now. Two. Jeff says on the black wall. Thank you for that. All right, two on the black wall. All right, I'm going to put this one up. I'm not sure if you guys are into the Larry stuff, but this one, I like this one because I like the casting. Let me just take a look if it's a chase one. I don't think it is. All right. Let's just put that in there. In the meantime. All right, so we got two from Jeff Lang. Oh, no, sorry. We're, Wayne Farr's already got three on the black wall. My mistake. I was re looking on the other side. It looks like a, yeah, it looks like an arrow star. And uh, there we go. Wayne Farr has actually put the three dollar bid on the black wall. I'm sorry, my mistake. I didn't. I mean, miss miss seen that one. I think I said it and I didn't remember it later. <laughs> Sometimes you get a little busy here. All right, I was too busy looking for Dennis Barr on what kind of thing I can put up in Larry's garage. So let's put a little bit of Larry's in there. Of course, I like this Roadster. That's why I put it up. <laughs> That's one of my favorite ones. Looking looking Roadsters. All right. In the meantime, <laughs> let's sell off the black wall. Let's get some. Uh, Bids on the last there. All right. Somebody says, shout, sir. Mr. Kiev. Kiev Lance Barcello. I'm not sure you are, but if you're new, please uh, register at diecasttv.com. It's important because that's where we know where to send stuff <laughs> and how you pay for stuff and how we build stuff. It's all that. So you got to do that. If you go to diecasttv.com, Brandon Helmke says 10. I think, believe it's on the Larry's. Right, Dennis Barr says five on the Larry's, but Brandon Hemke's already got ten already on the Larry's. In the meantime, the black wall's at three, and we're going to sell it off. The clock is ticking. Tick, 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 tick. It started going. All right, so we got 11 on Larry's from Dennis Barr in the meantime. All right. It's called Fair. It was card number 151. Thank you. All right, appreciate it. Appreciate that, Mike. I saw your message, too, as well. On the Roadster, yeah, I figured that. Uh, it's on the Roadster. I figured that. Now, 15 says on the Roadster, Brandon Hemke. In the meantime... The black wall is being sold right now. It's got uh, 
We got it with, um, oh my goodness, Jeff. No, not Jeff Lang. It's on uh, it's a Wayne Farr. Sorry, my mistake. I'm trying to people's names on the end of my tongue. I can't get them out of my mouth. All right, hold on a sec. Wayne Farr. Got 10 seconds left on it. Looking over there. In the meantime, you got 16 from Dennis Barr. You got Brandon Helmke. He's got 20 on the Larrys. Okay. There we go. Sold, sold, sold with Arrow Stars. Sold. All right, so that one's sold. That's not a chase. No, that's not a chase right now, okay, on that Larrys. It's just cool looking. <laughs> that's why I put it in there. <laughs> I liked it. I thought it was nice. All right, let's take a close look at it, though, in the meantime. Nice little roadster. White interior. Sweet little rod. Back in. It's got a nice, look at that front end, it's nice. It's got the rubbery old tires. All right. It's not a chase, so there you go. All right, so there we go. All right, so right now, Brandon Helmke's got it for 20. All right. And it looks like we'll put a clock on it. Let's put the clock on that one. Let's get it rolling. All right. Thanks, uh, David, for that information, too, by the way. I didn't know it was a card, what card number it was. It's cool. I think I've seen it, too, in, my, in the sets all the time. All right, so here we go. 50 seconds here. Let's get the clock going there. We got the things. Uh, we got it rolling here. Get it rolling here. In the meantime, let's see what else I can muster up. Oh, my goodness. How many of these do I have? Lots of purple passions. <laughs> you already got the chase. You wanted to get the non-chase one. That's pretty cool. So right now, 35 seconds. Brandon Helmke's got it. And let's go here. We got. I put in the uh, showroom just so you know a little something. You'll see any sets coming up. Sets as in sets. Let me see what I got. Like full sets of stuff. I'm not sure. I'll see what I can do. I have to look around what I got here. 12 seconds left. 10. Here we go. It looks like Brandon's got it going once. Brandon Helmke. Going twice, and it looks like it's sold, sold, sold. That Larry's is gone now. There we go. Okay, so here we go. In the meantime, I put, I know this one looks like a, a <laughs> Dwayne Weiss is 15 on the mail, and you know I need more than that. Now that's what looks like a color-changing Porsche. It used to be. It's very deceiving with that uh, pinkish hue. <laughs> I think over the years, that's what happens. Uh, black wall is uh, an old, old car. But it looks in pretty clean shape, though. And I bet you that turned red. It used to be white and probably turned red. And that's why it's the color the way it is. So just so you know, it's pretty cool. All right, that's cool. So three, Wayne Farce is three on the black wall right now. And that's where that Porsche is sitting. All right. Looks like a 959 or something like that. Something like that. Looks like that. I'm just like looking off the top of my head. And let's uh, go something, uh, what else do I got in here? I got that, I got that, that's okay. Oh, let's see here. What shall we do, what shall we do? All right, any Mopar guys in the house? I'm just trying to mix it up a bit. A little bit of Mopar. Let's see what I got. I got one of these. Let's do one of these. All right. Let's do a simple, simple one there. A little bit of super bird. <laughs> I figured that was a color changer. It was too deceiving. Yesterday we had that Ferrari that was a color changing one. And I think this this one, yeah, 959 says right on it. So it's, uh, it was, I believe that went, to, went to probably from white to red. And that's why it looks like that orange color. Because over the years, I guess, the paint changed. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Five on the bird. Ah, oh, yes, there he is. <laughs> There's Mike and Amy. He's got propped their uh, attention on the Mopar. How you, how you doing there, Mike? I really want to know about, uh, you know, Superbird is eight. Wayne Farr says Superbird's got eight, and Wayne Farr's got three. Brandon Helps sends ten on the Superbird. And that's just before Dave Weiss says ten. So we got on the uh, sh showroom car, we got three, and that's Wayne Farr. And we got 12 on the Superbird from Wayne Farr right now. On the Superbird. <laughs> on the Superbird. Yeah, I'll put up, I can put this, uh, the mail in in a minute here. We'll do that in a little bit later. All right, so we got 15, says Mr. Weiss, on the bird. Cool casting, that's all I got to say on this one. If I could uh, do that, <laughs> that's cool. 
20 says uh, Brandon Helmke. Okay. 20 bucks. He's in there for 20 bucks on this one on the Superbird. Number 25 of 30 in that Classic Series 3. Wayne Forrest says he's out. That was a bomb. I think that was dropped by Mr. Brandon Helmke. He's not that calm, those Superbirds, but there you go. So here we go. The Mopar Superbird right now. Plymouth is going. Let's just going to give the old top view, too, just so you see the 68 on top. It's pretty cool. 426, pretty awesome. Okay. I think, I think you're absolutely right. It's one of the best. I know my brother likes the Roger Dodger, but I think I like this one in the classics. This is pretty pretty serious. I also like the trucks that they do, like the Anglias and those kind of things. I want some customs. I want you. <laughs> some deep pockets, I think. Brandon, got the clock on that one. Let's do that. Let me just put the old. All right, there we go. All right, let's start her up. Rock and roll. Here we go. We got this clock on. I think it's just more, the, more like the steps we're going through this. I would like some customs. I know I did that. It would be great. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> that bird is hot. It is hot, isn't it? Royal got his package. Had the bird inside. It's awesome. And they get the different color variations. It's pretty cool. It comes in red and orange, all that kind of stuff. It's pretty wicked looking. The gold one's nice, too. If you ever got the gold one. I know uh, some of the fellows uh, collect the gold uh, red lines. Mm. Reminds me of that. All right, so here we go. 14 seconds, 12, 13, 12. We got it there for 20 bucks, sir, Brandon. I think he's got this one all, all the way home on that bid, that's for sure. All right. Yellow, silver, red, red. I'll have to check. I don't know where you've seen that, but I'll find it. <laughs> all right, sold, sold, sold. There we go. And that's Brandon's got that one. All right, so there they go. All right, so you're talking about the... Where are you seeing that? <laughs> Where do you see these? You guys crack me up. Where do you see this stuff? <laughs> I'm not even know. All right. Oh no, <laughs> he missed them there. It was loose somewhere. Okay, I'll, I'll find it. What you're looking at? I'm trying to find it myself. All right. In the meantime, we got that portion there, and that's being sold right now. Wayne Farr's got it, I believe, at three bucks. Three dollars. We got them. We three bucks. We got them. Let's see, um, where are we going? What do we have last? We had Mopar, so let's do four, says Jeff Lang on the black wall. Thank you. Four bucks. Where do you see my yellow truck? That's what I'm looking for. Oh, I'll keep looking. Hold on, I don't know where you're looking at. It's tough when you can't see it. <laughs> I got blocked with some stuff. All right, so in the meantime, let's do a Ford. Let's do something with the Fords. Fun with Ford, no. Let's see here. We got a Ford delivery. In the meantime, we got Jeff Lang's got the Blackwell four bucks. I think we should put a clock on the four on the Porsche. Nine fifty-nine. Right now we got four dollars on Jeff Lang's got it right now. Four bucks. Alrighty. Five dollars says Wayne Far on the Blackwall. Alright. Or basic wheel. All right, eight on the classic. <laughs> I think he got just a glimpse of that classic. <laughs> He's got he put an eight dollar bid that slammed it down on there. All right, so Wayne Farr has got control of both. He's got the black wall at five bucks and the classic at that. And it's thirty seconds left on the clock on the nine fifty nine Porsche or Porsche. <laughs> I don't know. It's Porsche, I believe. Nine fifty nine. It's not a slant nose, but pretty nice looking anyway. I do like the slant note Porsche. My brother got me into the Porsches because he likes them, that's why. All right, so 10 seconds left on the 959. Here we go. Wayne Farr has got it for five bucks. I'm waiting for Jeff Lang to see if he wants it. It's got three seconds, two seconds. It's going to go. Sold, 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 sold. It's like the echo. All right, there we go. Wayne Farr has got it. <clears throat> and he got it there for, he got it for five bucks. That one. All right, cool. Meantime, he's got $8 on the Ford Classic there, on the old Ford delivery. Pretty cool looking. All right, in the meantime, let's just put some uh, stuff. There we go, there we go, there we go. And he's got 8 on the Classics. And I'm looking for you for what we got here. Let's, I got another Stutz. All right, let's see here. 
Oh, thanks. Appreciate that. So it's good with some H2O, as they say. All right, so right now the classic Ford is at eight smackaroons. All right. And then we got to go somewhere else on this one. Uh, let's do that. And let's do that. We're doing a mixed mash of stuff. What's the green truck black wall? Green truck black wall. Man, you got good eyes. Where are you seeing this stuff? Well, the green, oh, right here, okay. Looks like a byway man to me. <clears throat> so, let me just take a, take a look at it. But I don't think it's, a, I don't think this one's called a byway man. I'm not sure. Might be. I'll put it in the, I'll put it in the old showroom there for you. You can tell me. You can tell me about it. Looks like a byway man to me. It looks like. I'm, I'm not sure if the, that's what they called it earlier on in the, in the old thing. So we got a white Camaro in the backyard. I'll see what I can do. White Camaro. You guys, are, you guys got great eyes, man. How do you see all that stuff? I can't even see it. I'm sitting right in front of the damn things. All right, so let's uh, let's get that's the that's what the green truck is. The black wall. All right. Possible an S10. Yeah. See, I didn't want to say it was a. It sure looks like a byway man, and I know I was reading about byway man because. Long time ago, when we first started, somebody asked me for a byway man. I was like, okay, let me see what I can do. And I was like, what is a byway man? I can't find them. And then, yeah, Eagle Eyes is definitely what's going on here. In the meantime, we got the eight on the classics. So Wayne Farr's got that eight on the classics. Let's put a clock on the weight on the classics. In the meantime, I've got a little bit of a rig too here. Let's see what we can do. All right, so we got three on the black wall from Wayne Farr as well. So we got that. Yeah, we says three on the two as well. But we got three from Wayne Farr right now for now. All right, so there we go. <clears throat> All right, so he brought me some water. Look at that. Mike's a great producer. Run out and got some water. Jeff, you're a little bit low on the black wall right now. It's at three. We had it from Wayne Farr first. And David Weiss came in a little bit later on the three in the meantime. And we got eight on the classic. So let's sell off. Did I, we were selling my classic already. We got 15 seconds left on the classic. So let's get some bids in. Nope. There we go. It's all good. Oh, he started a new clock. Sorry about that. We shouldn't have jumped in like a new clock. But right now it's got $8. Wayne Farr has got it. It's okay because uh, I didn't know where it was either. <laughs> so, until I reminded myself. All right, so here we go. We're going to sell her off. All right, we're going once. Let's sell this thing off. Let's sell it off. We'll just sell it off. I'll just call it. It's easier because I think uh, we don't, I think nobody else is jumping in. All right, so here we go. Going once on the classic. Going twice on the classic. Yeah. <laughs> All right, sold, sold, sold. Yeah, there we go. All right, but there is a... I originally had a guy come in here looking for for those things, and that's why I was I've always been searching for them. That's why, but they're not that many. That's the other thing. They didn't, they didn't make it that many of these guys. Although I have two of them here, <laughs> sitting in my sitting in my showroom on the floor. All right, so and that's where that is. So we're at that S10 byway man, whatever it is. Right now it's at three dollars, and uh, I'm just gonna set up my uh, garage in a minute. All right, all right so we're. We can't give it away. We want to give it away. We want to hide it first. We want to sell this one off. Five. Brandon Helmke says five bucks on the black wall. All right. So there we go. Yeah, that's all right. So yeah, I'm going to do a little bit different style than my brother. You know what I'm saying? Let's go one side, then the other side, then one side, and the other side. That would be cool. I think that works, I think. Yeah. So let's get a clock on this one. We got Brandon Helmke's on five on the black wall. In the meantime, all right. So here we go. <clears throat> we got 50 seconds going on, counting it down, all right? Okay. This looks like some kind of funny one. Oh, 10 on the on low rides. <laughs> Dave Weez is awesome. 10, I did want to, I need to start on the classics. The 10, and you guys read my mind. So Wayne Farr has got 10 on the classics, but I'm going to hide, I have to hide those things first. <laughs> I'm trying to get it you know, in a real bit of a motion roll. <clears throat> All right, so here he goes. <laughs> settled. Work settled, but I was good to stay. Oh, my goodness. You cracked me up. 
All right, so I I was trying to pick something that I knew, might know that you need, so that's why I was looking for something. So here we go, the Bioway Man or the S10 Helmkey. He's got it right now, going five. So are they sold, 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 Brandon Helmkey, and he's got it for five smackaroonies. All right, there we go. So now I put in, as you notice, I trying to trying to switch it all up. So I got a Chevy set in the classics. Now, there's two of them there. There's a 62 Chevy Bubble Top, which is really cool, and the 65 Chevelle Malibu, also very cool Chevs and back in the day. And, of course, these guys are low looking. The stance is nice on them. And that's why I kind of picked those two as a little bit of a, a set. So those are pretty cool. So right now we got Wayne Fars on them at 10 bucks on the Classics. <laughs> I only come to work so I can spend here. <laughs> you got to love that. You got to love that. All right. So there we are. We got the two Chevys. I'll put a little bit close up on them in a minute. I have, let's put the one close up and you get to see that. Hopefully I'll get that a little bit better. So you get a nice close up. There you go. I just want to put it over there so you get a nice close up of it. I'll put the, uh, the old Vanna White on it as well. No problem. Pretty cool looking on the top. It's got nice lines. All right, so there we go. <laughs> Priorities, he says he's awesome. Got the red line on the tires. In the meantime, I'll put the other one down too so you can see them both. Pretty cool looking. 15, says Brandon, on the classics, all right? In the meantime, the top, pretty nice looking white interior. It's a gold color. Very nice spectra frame on that. All right, so we have 15 on the classics. <clears throat> all right, there we go. Robert Bergner is might still be around there, Anthony. <laughs> So we've got the two classics there. It's at 15 bucks right now. Brandon's got it. Nothing in the showroom. Let's put something in the showroom. Um, let's see here. What do I got here? I got like a doozy or something. What is this? An Auburn. Let's put an Auburn in there. A little bit of classic style. Great Pouponish. <laughs> Blackwall. In the meantime, we'll throw that in there and just put it in that showroom there. In the meantime, we're going to sell off... The classics right now will put a clock on it for Brandon Helmke. <clears throat> See what's going on. Okay. There we go. We got a little bit of 43 seconds on the clock. There we go on the two classics. There's two Chevy classics, so I thought I'd put it in there. And Brandon has got that one today so far. He's doing well. It's nice to see you back in here. Haven't seen you for a while. All right, so we're going there. 24 seconds left. <clears throat> and we got Jeff Lang. You put one on the black wall, I think. Is that correct? I believe so. We got 16 on the classics for Dale Nelson. He just jumped in. We'll put a new clock on that one. <clears throat> Excuse me. Put a new clock on that one. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, there we go. <clears throat> oh, my goodness. That frog is getting big. Wayne Forrest is 18 on the classics. Okay. Thanks, Jeff. Jeff on uh, YouTube has uh, put a $1 bid on the black walls. <clears throat> so we got that started, and we got waiting for 18 on the classics on Facebook side. Oh, four. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. Just uh, private message me. I'll figure I'll sort you out there, Brandon. Dale Nelson says 20 bucks on the classics. That's where we're at. Richard Flem said five dollars on the black wall. Mr. Lang, you got some competition on this one. I think he likes them black walls. All right, I got a little interesting one here. Yours, Dale. There he goes. Wayne's Fars uh, letting you have it. There you go. So here we go. Going uh, clock is on thirty seconds right now, and we got Dale Nelson. He's got it in there. <coughs> All right, it's got 20 seconds left. Looks like it's going to go. Wayne Farr was into it, but he's being a gentleman and letting Dale have it. Unless uh, anybody else has got anything to say about it. Eight seconds left. Five seconds left. Four, three, two. It's going to go. Sold, sold, sold. Dale Nelson got it for 20 smackaroonies. There we go. He's in there. All right, so that's sold and sold. The two of them there, awesome. All right, in the meantime, we got the Auburn in the showroom. Let's take a look. We got $5 with Richard Flem. And that's where we're sitting right now. 
in the meantime. <clears throat> All right. And Richard Flynn's got the Auburn at five smackers. All right. It's pretty cool. Uh-oh. I've lost all my screen. Hold on here. Yep, it's lost here. Hold on a sec. Let me see what's going on here. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to get back in here. <clears throat> I lost my friend's screen in here, so that's all right. We're just going to reconnect somehow. Hold on a sec. I think something has happened. But bear with me. <clears throat> Last I had was $5 and leave it at the black wall, so we'll keep it there for a second. All right. And I don't say any bids yet, but uh, we'll get it sorted out in a second here. I'm sure. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. And while I do this. All right. I got my backups. I got to get back in here. Hold on a sec here. Sorry about this, guys. All righty. I got that in there. Got the Auburn there, I see that. All right, let me just get the bids, uh, see what I got in there. All right, so I got a little bit of a black screen here, so that's why I'm just uh, sorting things out. We got a little bit of a gremlin kicking around. All righty. All right, so there you go. We got five from Richard's Rich. <laughs> Richie Rich has got it. All right, on the Auburn, I see that. Let me just uh, <clears throat> sort out here. And what I got to see here. Hold on a sec. So in the meantime. All right. Let's sell it off. Looks like going to be sold in a minute here. All right. And I'll just Richard Flem. I'm just running it out now. Hold on a sec. Richard Flem. It's going to be going. <clears throat> All right. In the meantime, let's see here. What's the you? All right. Sold, sold, sold. Richard Flam's got it for five smackaroonies. Let me just set something else up in the old showroom. I got a little bit of Ultra Hots in uh, Mustang. And you'll see it there. In the uh, front there, in the uh, I'm just gonna sell this one off, put this one off. There we go, and go in the old garage. We got a little bit of Ultra Hots there. All right, so let's start that bidding on at least five dollars on the Ultra Hots. Let's get her going here. Okay, in the meantime. All right, sorry about that. Had some gremlins in the house still. <laughs> Trying to fight them off. All right, there we go. No problem. All right, so that's the where we're sitting right now. In the meantime, we got uh, Richard Flemings. Give me the thumbs up. That's awesome. Okay, cool stuff. All right, so in the meantime, we got an ultra hot Mustang. Pretty cool. Let's start the bidding at least at five bucks on that. In the meantime, where are we at? Okay, three bucks from John R. Bennett. Should be fine. There we go. Okay, cool. Okay. In the meantime, we got a few little gremlins in the house. All right, so let's get it rolling here. All right. Mr. John R. Bennett on YouTube has $5 bid on the uh, Mustangs. Mustangs. Mustang. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Let's get that black wall in the meantime. All right, so cool. You have, do you have the Stang in white? That's seven dollars from Dale Nelson's on the Mustang. I, that one in white. You know, I've seen it, but I don't think I have it with me right now, next to me, unfortunately. So right now, Dale Nelson has jumped in on Facebook. He's got the Mustang at seven right now. Okay. In the meantime, let's see where we're at. We got John R. Bennett. He was in at five, but then Dale Nelson came up at seven. In the meantime, here we go. Okay, so far so cool. Okay, cool. Thanks. Oh, <laughs> it's okay. All right, cool. No problem. I do come to Canada for it. <laughs> John Bond. John R. Bennett has the one Richard Fleming White. <laughs> He's in Canada, though. 
Ah, oh, there we go. Rob Strong is laughing. It's, it's funny. All right, so here we go. All right, now 10. David Weiss says 10 on the Mustang. 10 on the Mustang. David Weiss for the Ultra Hots, 10. All right, that's where we're at right now. Sitting at David Weiss says 10 on the Stang. All right, 10 on the Stang, 10 on the Stang. And Dale Nelson jumps in at 12 on the Mustang. Okay, fair enough. 12 on the Mustangs. Mustang. <laughs> Why am I saying Mustangs? What am I talking about? All right, so here we go. Yes, those are supers, actually. A little super uh, treasure hunts in the background here. You got one, one in white in the black interior. Okay, we'll see what I can do. <laughs> I'll have to call up the, the old Ford and see what happens. <laughs> got to make an order. All right, so we got Dale Nelson at $12 on the Mustangs. A Mustang. <laughs> Again, I'm talking about in plural. What the heck am I doing? All right, so here we go. Let's see if we put a clock on it. What do you think? Let's put a clock on that bad boy. 50 seconds. Let's get it rolling. It's all good. All right, there we go. I'm looking at the looking at the boards here. I'm looking at them. See what's going on. We know that Dale Nelson's got it right now. I'm putting the paperwork down in Dale's name. Right now. All right, there we go. It's going once to Dale Nelson. And 30 seconds is just past the clock. It's now down to 24 seconds, 23 seconds, 22. Here we go. And he's got it for 12 smackaroonies. It's going once, going twice. If I can time my saying. Alrighty. Looks like it's going to be sold. You got it there, Dale. Let's get four seconds. Three, two, one. And it looks like it's going to be sold, sold, sold. You got it. Beautiful buy. Oh, little Ultra Hots, Real Riders, pretty cool looking car. 12 Smackaroonies. All right, so far so good. All right, next uh, we got in the showroom there. Let's take a look. Let's see, you know, one of the rigger, rigs. Uh, I can't remember if this one had the box on it or the dump truck. I can't remember if the blue one or the red. I can't, you know, I, my memory kills me. <laughs> I miss it sometimes. Little black wall rig. That's the only way you can do that. You can always customize it, Dave Weiss says. <laughs> you can always customize it. All right, so Wayne Forrest says three on the black wall. Thanks. So he always likes to open my bidding with the three on the black walls. In the meantime, let's do something different. <laughs> We're going with nerds. We're going with nerds. <laughs> what is the place coming to? <laughs> We're going with nerds, VW bus. <laughs> The nerds are in the house. The nerds. You got to love nerds. I think that's even real rider nerds. <laughs> I love it. It's got that blue stuff. That's pretty cool. Oh, it needed plane. That's why uh, Richard needs that one. Okay, he's doing some custom work. All right, pretty cool. So right now, there we go. Look at that nerds thing. <laughs> that's two on the nerds. You got to get more than two for the nerds. Come on. <laughs> Let's get a roll in here. That was with the fun dip and stuff. And the sweet tart. Remember the sweet tart? We sold that the other day, the sweet tart. Three, says Mike and Amy on the nerds. Meantime, Wayne, Wayne Farr's got the black wall at three bucks. Five on the nerds from Robert Lewis. Five on the nerds. Justin Under comes in at six on the nerds. I'm looking for Scooby-Doo. Don't worry. I do have the mystery machine, but that's in my private collection. You can't have that one. <laughs> right now, we got Justin Under at six dollars on the nerds. He's got the nerds. Oh, yeah. The other day, Mike saw the giant, giant Monster Jam Scooby-Doo. Like, we're talking huge. It was huge, but huge. So we thought, oh, maybe we'll just order one just for fun. All right, so here we go. Justin uh, Justin Under. Or I know his name is Steve, but I won't say anything. Justin Under is on the nerds. Oh, Damien Harris says seven on the nerds. Seven on the nerds. My wife wants it, Wayne Farr says. I, hey, man, it's one of those things. It's a VW, which is cool. And the nerds, it's funny. Oh, you're looking for the... I don't have the super... If you can find it, David, I'm in. I want the super mystery. I, do, I have the the one with the real riders that came, you know, that kind of one. So right now, we got to seven on the nerds, Damian Harris. Damian Harris has seven on the nerds. <laughs> the nerds, I love it. 
I love it. It's like blueberry nerds too, or something. Blueberry and lime or something like that. Is that what that is? Raspberry and green apple. Mike knows. What kills me is Mike actually knows this information. <laughs> oh, I gotta love Mike. All right, so Damien's got seven. Justin Under says he's out on the nerds. Do we got a clock on these nerds yet? Hold on. Well, let's put a clock on these nerds. Put a clock on the nerds. <laughs> I love it. Oh, let's see here. VWT ones. Let me say. Let me see what's on the on the board here. Okay. Oh my. Oh now see we got to talk there, uh, Mr. Weiss. He's got a super mystery. I want that one. All right. All right. They're talking to each other. So right now we got uh, Damian Harris. He's got seven bucks on the nerds. Twenty three seconds left. What's going on? Twenty seconds left. Here we go. 15. Wayne, are you in or what? Let me know. Robert says he's out. Hey, he respects that Mike knew that. <laughs> John R. Bennett, give me some respect. All right, it's going to sold, sold, sold. Damien Harris has got the nerds. <laughs> Damien Harris got the nerds for seven smack Rudies. All right, that's funny. He knew that was a green apple and raspberry. I'm still I'm still flabbergasted over that he knows the nerds. I the, hate the green apple. The, oh, that's why he doesn't like the green apple. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's funny stuff. That's funny business. All right, so let's see what else we got in here. Hold on, I'm gonna get some other. If you guys like the nerds, let's see what else I have in store. Oh, we already did that one. I got some. Uh, let me look for a T1. I'm trying to find a T1 for you. In the meantime, we got the black wall. I believe. It's at three with Wayne Farr. We got a lot of Marvel stuff kicking around here. Hold on a sec. Let me just fight through the Marvel stuff. All right, I'm looking for T1s. I don't see any. All right, so hold on. Love the pop cards or serious cards. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Let me see. We got four on the black wall. I see that Jeff Lyon came in at four on the black wall. All right, that's cool. I don't want to split up sets here. I don't know. I'm, I didn't put the sets up today, like the the board. So here I am. I don't want to mix up sets and break up sets that might be. Okay, so it's three, four. I don't want to squish. Oh my goodness. I'm worried. I don't want them to be split up. All right, so I got like Avenger stuff. All right, let's try this. We're at five on the black wall. <clears throat> Sorry about that. I just clued out for a second trying to find stuff. <laughs> but the black wall right now is at five smack Roonies. Minus Marvel. <laughs> okay, okay, Mr. Weiss. I won't put any Marvel up. <clears throat> I'm overwhelmed with Marvel here. Oh, let's do this. I got something different. All right, so here we go. All right, here we go. Let's see what we got. Can you tell me the year of that truck? The year of this truck. Let me just take a close look at it. Actually, let's take a close look at this in the meantime. Let me uh, go. I'll tell you what. Why don't I put it in the uh, the garage for a second? Because you know what? I need, <laughs> I need the assistance of the magnifying <laughs> to see. So let's do this. Hopefully I did it the right way. Hold on a sec. Where's the writing on this? Upside down? Yeah, this is the way it is. Okay, so it's like this. Okay. Take a close look at that. So help me if you don't if you see it. I can't see where the time date is on this one. Hold on a sec. So I can't it's fine. If you guys can see, can you see it there, uh, Mike? The date? You see when it was done, it's, I can't read it from my eyes because I three bright lights on me and this is all. All right, in the meantime, let me take a close look. Hold on a second. Maybe my eyes will help me. M2 haulers, let me see what I can do. Hold on. All right, you know what I do next? Is if I can't see it, I got to go with the uh, magnifying glass. And my magnifying glass is like getting my phone out. 
And there we go. It says 79. <laughs> David, you're amazing. That's all I got to say. <laughs> That's all I got to say. <laughs> How did you know that? I know John, Johnny on comes in at 79 too. Appreciate the help, guys. All right, cool. So that's what it is. 79 from the guys. Oh, I appreciate you guys. Yeah, I know. Wait, I couldn't see anything. I don't, and then I, I had to bring out the old, bring out the old uh, phone with the camera on it and enlarge it. That's how bad my eyes are. Oh, it's all those years in front of stage lights, I think. <clears throat> Burned out my eyes. All right. Okay. All right. So there we go. All right. Okay. Here we go. So I got a little bit of uh, Whips Team, uh, Borchwell, New School, Cadillac, Escalade. <laughs> little hip hop New School. <laughs> Thought of, yeah, Eagle Eyes Weez. <laughs> Don't tell me you spotted that, Sevy. I think you knew that. Close above the black wall. Uh, yeah, sure, if you want. Where are we with that black wall? Hold on a sec. In the meantime, we have three dollars from far. And then is that you wanted four on that one, Jeff? Let me know because I'm I'm reading from. A oh, Wayne Far says four bucks, but I think Jeff Lang had four before you. Jeff Lang jumped in at four. Well, what are you talking about? We need to get the 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 Escalade's got to start at five bucks. So if you're gonna be on the Escalade. You got to get five bucks. Let me get the five bucks in, and that's cool. <laughs> John Bennett goes, what is that blue thing? <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's kind of like, uh, you know. That's the number one DJ in New York. Oh, okay. Oh, is that Funkmaster Flex thing? Oh, okay, cool. That's pretty cool. All right, so here we go. Hey, I got my screens back up. That's pretty cool. And right now, let me know. If, we, if you want to get that, Jeff Lang, you want that uh, close-up, I can do a little bit better. <laughs> Rom Strong says it's a boat anchor. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool. It's like a hip-hop kind of vibe. Cadillac Escalade. Somebody was asking me about Escalades during the week. So I put it in there. So $5, Wayne. I think that's you're on the uh, Escalade, right? Is that what it is? Find the boxes for haul. Okay. No problem. Okay, cool. All right, so here we go. Yeah, you already did. I'm good. Okay, cool. Thanks, Jeff. Appreciate it. And are you a four on the on the black wall? That's what I want to know. You're at four, I think. I think Wayne Farr was bidding on the other one. Let me know. All right? So I think right now, I think Jeff... <laughs> what, am I, what did he say? Hold on. I got uh, John R. Bennett saying some stuff. Like, Hold on. Was it kind of person asked another person about an next clip? I don't know. People are asking me. I get questions like that. Five on both, says Wayne Farr. Okay, he's got five on both. That's why it was a general five bid <laughs> on everything. Just bid everything on five bucks. That's all right. Let's do that. <laughs> all right, so here we go. We have five bucks on the whips and five bucks on the rig. All right, there. Now that now we're up to date. All right, that's good. I like to say that. All right, let's get a clock on the uh, on the rig. Let's might as well get that sold. And let's see, I got some, let's see what else I got here. I'll see. <clears throat> All right. Started already. It's got it going. Yeah, 47 seconds left. Wayne wants that blinger. <laughs> yeah, I think so. It's got them wheels. It's got the spinner wheels. No, it doesn't have spinner wheels. I wonder if ever Hollows did make a spinner wheel. Let me know if you guys know. Yeah, I mean, uh, some spinner spinners, you know. <laughs> I'd like to see that. All right, so hold on a second. New York Nick Latrell Sprewell invented the spinners. The really, Latrell Sprewell invented the spinners. That one, that's what the information is I'm getting right now. They're called Sprewells. What? Oh, they're called Sprewells. They are. All right, here we go. We're gonna sell it off here. Ten seconds left on the black wall. All righty, here we go. Looks like it's going the way far. No slots. Well, I actually do have a slot car, if you guys are interested. I have a real cool one, a black uh, uh, Batman one. All right, so let's go on here. We got this one. It was sold for 5 bucks. Hold on, let me get this out of the way. All right, in the meantime, how loud is the stereo? And how many times is it repossessed? <laughs> oh, my. John R. Bennett, 
I miss your humor. <laughs> oh my God, that's funny. That's funny business. <laughs> that's very funny. All right, I'll tell you what. In the meantime, Richard Flem is asking me for a slot car. So hold on a sec. You guys trying to see how loud that stereo goes. There won't be any prints playing right now, but just a sec. Found something. Hold on, let me see here. I'm not sure if you guys are interested, but let's see. I'll put it in the showroom. <laughs> let's see here. Check this out. All right, so I got, I, for some reason, on one of the collections, I got a Batmobile slot car. Now it's got, if you look closely, it's got Batman and Robin in the driver's seat, in the passenger seat. I'm putting it in the showroom. <laughs> you guys can take a look at it. <laughs> Check this out. So here we go. We'll flip around. You'll see the other sides there. Check that out. It's in great shape. I don't think it was ever used. And we got to start the bidding on that. I think we got to start at least at least at 15 bucks. I think, on that slot car. Because that slot car Zlatka is a little bit old. I think when it first came out, it looks like, to me, the sticker price was already at 20 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> so just saying now I'm not sure if you guys into that slot car stuff but there's a slot car I put it in there it's pretty cool it's got uh, Batman and Robin so I drive it along I could just imagine this do me a favor then Mike just move the okay it's, it's kind of in there 10 on the slot it's a I'm telling you it's it's awesome I don't think it's ever been used it's been in this package ever since so Thunderjet 500 Johnny Lightning, of course, made these ones. This is pr pretty cool. Richard Flem says twenty-five bucks. He sees ten thirty dollars on the slot right now. Dale Nelson's got thirty bucks on the slot. All right, there you go. So we got the bids going on the slot. Let's start selling. Let's start selling on that slot. Let's take a look at this. I got real interested in the slot, so that's pretty cool. I was gonna get some sets in here, but we'll see. David Weiss is at thirty-two. Uh oh, <laughs> I found another weakness of David Weiss. The thirty-two uh, slot car. It's awesome. Pretty cool. What does it say on the house? Handles like a real race car. <laughs> I love that. 35 on the slot. Dale Nelson says 35 bucks. What year is it? Man, I, I Richard, I'm really not familiar with... How am I going to know the year on this one? Hold on a sec. Slides through turns with a realistic drift action. <laughs> I love it. I love this thing. Oh, adult collectors, real race car. I can't see a date on it. Maybe on the bottom. Maybe check the bottom. We'll just we're just checking the bottom for you. Let's see. Is there any kind of date on there? 2002. 2002. 2002. That's what's on there, Richard. So 35 bucks <clears throat> right now. Dale Nelson's got it. 35 dollars. And I do have another one. I can't believe I have another one. <clears throat> While I was looking for this one, went back to get it. I found this ne right next to it. I forgot I had two. I have two slot cars. We'll put them up. You guys are in the slot cars. I, I knew I, that's another avenue we wanted to get into, but I'm really not familiar with slot cars too much. I know the price on this one because the guy, when the guy sent it to me, he told me. And uh, Dale Nelson's got it for 35 bucks right now. Let's put a clock on the slot car. <laughs> Let's put a clock on the slot car. Oh, forget the Escalade right now. Let's go on the slot car. <laughs> this, this is more exciting. All right, here we go. Let's uh, let it roll. All right, so here we go. Dale Nelson's got 35 on the slot car as we speak. Robert Lewis is patiently waiting for something. I'm not sure what. But I'll try to, I'm trying to cater to everybody. I'm sorry about that. Sometimes I, you know, go off on tangents. But that's the musician in me. <laughs> the improvisation in me. The best part of this car is that we got Batman and Robin sitting inside, <laughs> drifting along. I got to love it. All right, so there we go. 24 seconds left on the slot car. 36, says Richard Flem. Restart that clock on the slot car. All right, Richard Flem's at 36 bucks. Gravits tonight. You want to get some? I can do some Gravits if you like. We'll see what we got here in Gravits. I'll do the. I can do the eight, the crazy eights if you like. 40 on the slot car, says Dale Nelson. 40 smackaroonies on that Batmobile. That Batmobile is untouched. I'm telling you right now. 
I opened up the shell just to show you guys. $40 on the slot. Here we go. We got 42 seconds on the clock. So if the red clock was reset at 40 bucks on the slot card. I mean, this makes me want to get in the slot cars. This car sells used, sells for about 40 bucks used. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thanks for that, Dwayne. I didn't know that. This one's this one's like untouched, unopened. Well, I opened the top. But uh, hasn't been, I don't think it's been taken off the uh, pedestal. It's got a little bit of a tie down on it. So that's pretty cool. So 40 bucks, there you go. That's going to be a good deal then. Dale, take it. <laughs> All right, there you go. It's going once, going twice to Dale Nelson. He's got it. I'm telling you, it's in amazing shape too. All right, so there we go. Sold, 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 Dale. You got it. You got our first, our first. Oh, you're a Batman fan too. But you're our first slot guard sale. That's awesome. But this is cool though. I just, I mean, I never opened it up to take a close look at it, but it is amazing. Okay, so here's another, here's that. That was the, that's the Batmobile. All right, so here's an, here's another one. Okay, let me put up, I'll put up another one. Richard Flem has a hundred of them. And it's, this one's in great shape. All right, I'll show you another one. Take a look at this one. And this one is a hundred years of Chevrolet electric slot car. And this one's another Thunder Jet. Okay, so this is going to be a Johnny Lightning. And let me just, 2000. Oh, I can't see it. My eyes are so bad. Mike, I might need you this one. If you want to know the, I think it's there somewhere. <laughs> it's there somewhere. All right, I'll show you another one. All right, let's, let's get it. I'll get the two slot cars out of the way. I'll 2011. Sell it. What is it? 2011. 2011. So this one's a little bit more modern. But it's a Corvette convertible. Let me just get it nice and set. Step. Pretty cool. This one I don't think has been outside the box either. It's just, just I had two. these two guys, they take, both came with a collection. And the guy had some more, and I didn't know what to do with the slot car. So I just said, okay, give me a couple of them. Let's see what they are. I think this one's in pretty good shape, too. So let's get let's get the bidding. At least start it on this one for 15 bucks, and we'll get her going here. All right, so here we go. Got Dale Nelson. He's got that Batmobile. That Batmobile is smoking, though. I must admit, that was pretty cool. Almost, almost I want to get some track in here now. <laughs> in the lunch hour, we'll be doing some races, my brother and I. A hundred on the trunk. Uh oh, you know something. Yes, it says a hundred on the trunk. <clears throat> yes, it does, Richard. He knows something. Mr. Flem knows something about this car then. It's pretty cool. I have to admit, it was from a collector. It was from a, like a collector. Had all kinds of cool stuff. And this happened to be coming with it, the set that I bought. So that's pretty cool. In the meantime, don't forget about the Escalade. The Escalade, I've forgotten through all the excitement. Oh, he's got. <laughs> He's got this one. Oh, no. 15, Dale Nelson says. 15 bucks he's going to get. That's a good deal for 15 bucks. That's a good way to get that one. Okay. And then the Escalade. Let me know what was the... Let me go back on the on bidding on the on the Escalade. I think it was like something like that. Five or something like that. I got too excited about this uh, the slot car. I think the Escalade is a Funk Max. <laughs> Funk Master Flex. Five on both. Yeah, Wayne Farr's got it. So Wayne Farr. Let's sell off the Escalade and we'll go off to we'll go to the slot car in a minute. Oh, you have it in Rich. Richard, man, you're the man with the slot cars. That's for sure. I, I told you I gotta talk to you about those in the meantime. You gotta train me a little bit on these. These Thunder Jets are cool though. Now there was a Thunder Jet that they made, right? That the you could take the body off and slip onto these, I believe. That's I was remember reading that kind of stuff. I was getting in the meantime, get the clock going on the old Escalade and get that rolling there. Richard Flem is the man for slot cars. That's what I know. So next time I call you, let's have a little chat about the slot cars. Those are pretty cool. And I know that they did the Thunder Jet. I had a bunch of Thunder Jets in here. I remember that. Somebody got them. Somebody in here got them. I can't remember who. Oh, I can't remember if I knew, only knew. I forget. All right, so. Yeah, let's get the... Uh, <laughs> I agree with you, Robert Lewis. Let's get the Escalade out of here. <laughs> It's going down seven. It's got Wayne Forrest's name on it. Hold on. Let me write it out before I forget. And it was five bucks. And let's get that thing out of here. Funk Master Flex. You're gone. <laughs> Three, two, one. So, so, so. There we go. Let's get it down here. Boom. It's gone. All right. So there we go. Wayne Forrest got it. Put it on there. Pretty cool, but not as cool as a slot car. Let's get back to that slot car. <laughs> 
Hey, brown boy, you're back in the house. All right, there we go. So I got this other vet, 100 years of Chevy, and that's uh, yeah, it looks like a vet to me, and uh, 60, maybe 63 convertible, and uh, it's pretty cool. Any carded black walls? Let me see what I got here. I think I do. Well, I know I do. This one is is a little rough. The card is really rough, but I didn't want to undo it. And it's got the Mustang convertible inside. I'll put that up in a minute after that slot car goes out. That slot car is worth $25 easy. Thank you very much, sir, Richard Flem. I appreciate that. So right now, uh, it's a steal. Dale Nelson's got it for 15 smackaronis. That's a deal then, right there. He could probably turn around and flip it. There you go. So right now, Dale Nelson's got it for 15 bucks. Thanks for that little information. <clears throat> Let me get something in the old... Uh, in the old barnyard here. Hold on, we got too many Chevys in a row here. We're gonna have to do something about that. Gonna go have a fair fight, a fair thing tonight with all the different ones. All right, so here I do have Jeff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'll show you the one I got. It's the convertible Mustang, '65 convertible Mustang. I just kept it in the the. It's a 1982 one or '83, something like that. So right now, Richard Flem is golfing you the thing. He's got a great deal on this one right now. Dale Nelson's got it for 15 bucks. All right, so let's put a clock on that slot car. There you go. You do give some good deals here sometimes. You got it going on here. Especially, especially when these kind of things come up, they're pretty cool. And I don't mind giving the, giving the love, sharing the love. Especially collectors like you guys. It's awesome. All right, don't forget, we got them uh, 29 buses coming in on Saturday. Hopefully, it'll be at my house on Saturday. So, Sunday, we'll try to get it in the old, on the block, get them rolling. And I got Super Treasure Hunts coming. Super Treasure, Super. 16, says Richard Flem. New clock on there. Thank you, Richard. Richard knows the value. He says, hey, it's 50. I'm going to get it for 16 bucks. He knows the value of this one. Cool. And I'm digging that, Richard. Thank you. All right, so there we go. We got clock down 37 seconds, and there we go. It's counting down. So there we go. I'm looking at it. I'm checking both sides. I've got something prepared already in the garage. We'll get to that in a second. Sorry, All right, yeah, yeah, of course. Let's go. Thanks for that, Mike. Producer Mike, he's running around. He's doing great stuff. All right, so it's cool. I I got you the bus. You know what? I'm a collector of buses too, right? So I, I got, you know, I got the bug. And this guy, I'm telling you right now, this collection has the Hall of Fame bus. Go Google it. Dale Nelson's 18 bucks on the slot. New clock, new clock, new clock. Oh, oh he just got in under four seconds. All right, man. Then the, my father has joined us. He's in the house today, too. All right, cool. So he's got 40 seconds on the clock on the slot car. And there we go at 18 bucks. Dale Nelson, still nice deal. No sweet deal deal there. Now, do you sell? Do you, Richard is the is the track valuable? Let me know that, because I had an opportunity to buy some tracks, some sets, all that kind of stuff. Guy had all kinds of Aurora stuff, all kinds of Tyco, old old tracks. And he had like the four lane tracks. Let me know if it's uh, worth getting into, because I, there was a guy here selling seventy five tracks, sets. It's pretty cool. So here we go. Eighteen. We got six seconds left. Five, four, three, two. And it's sold, sold, sold. There you go. Take it. There you go. Nice one. Nice one. Gentleman Lee, he says, Richard Flem, have it. It's yours. Yes. He says, yes, they're worth it. Okay, cool. I'm going to have to have a tell, talk about that. Because this guy has, I tell you right now, the guy had 75 tracks here locally. 75 of them for sale. All right. In the meantime, we got a little Ford action. I figured we'd get off the Chevy clock, go into the classic side. Hot Wheels, cool classics. The Ford Torino. Cool flame job on this one. Let's do that in there. In the meantime, let's put uh, the slocker. Goodbye there, Dale. Good little boy. They are boxed. All of them are boxed there, Richard. So, yeah, you let me know. I got to talk to you about that. Carded black wall. Now, I'll put that up. Hopefully, I'll, let me just stop the old stage here. Okay. All right, so there we go. We got uh, six on the cool classic. 
Now this one's rough. I'm telling you right now, the card is rough, but I didn't want to take it out of the blister pack because I know if you open it, then it's it'll be a nice card. So it's got like you know, it's, it's a pretty rough card. I mean, I'm I'm not gonna kid you. That stuff is it's been through the ringer a bit, but the car inside is still really nice. So let's get at least <clears throat> that's money. He says Richard Flynn, that's money. Okay. So let's take a close look. 65 uh, Mustang convertible. A little bit of a rough card. We're just getting it focused in there. Black wall, a white wall in this case. And let's start the bidding on that. At least one at $10. All right. Let's start the bid on 10 ones. That one's really a blister pull. It's going to be a mint condition. It's going to be great. All right. So that's that one there. Okay. That's pretty cool. In the meantime, I had a question about Dodge Classics. Let me see what I got. Russell Weichel's in the house, too. I saw him popping in. Let me see. We got straight pipes. Oh, I do have one. Whew. Okay, maybe I'll put this one in. All right, I got another cool classic set for you. I'll get that in there in a minute. So right now, let's take a look at this one. All right, so we got at least ten bucks on the carded wild black wall. All right. In the meantime, and I got the Spectra Frost, the old paint job. Any more Matchbox? You guys have got the little kick on the Matchbox stuff. Let me see what I got. Oh, I do have a couple things here. Let's see this. Oh, these are cool. Well, I didn't look. I didn't take a look at the what I got in Matchbox here. Let me see what I got. I'll put. I'll put a couple more. I'll put. I got some Matchboxes. I'll put up. All right. All right. Let's get her going. Let's. Meantime, let's sell these guys. So right there, I think Wayne Farr's got six on the classic. That's where we are with the classic right now. We got nothing on the uh, on the black wall there. 15 says on the Stang. 15 says Chris Peters on the Stang. All right. Tyrone Dark, how you doing, buddy? I got some boxes about to leave to go to you. Tyrone actually posted that he got some stuff from us. It was nice of him to put on their page there. It was pretty cool. All right, that's Skyline. Which is that one? This JDM. Ooh, that's nice, that white one. All right, I'll put that out. You know, I'll put all that stuff up in there for you. No problem. Here we go. So we got Chris Peters, 15 on the Stang. It's, uh, yeah, you can pull it off the blister, and then you can have a nice, perfect car. That's why I left it in there. I didn't want to open it up or anything. I'll let you guys do that in the meantime. That's pretty cool. And uh, I only had a few of them that came in this week that way, so that's just so you guys know. All right, so Chris, just in case, by the way, if you are new and you need to register at DieCastTV.com, it's important so we know where to ship stuff. <laughs> so just to verify your PayPal, that's important. And it'll charge you like a buck fifty, kind of like you know that to make sure it works. And then you submit. And in the meantime, you get for a buck fifty, you get fifty free listings too. By the way, on that page, and then you got name. Just put your name, your shipping address, and your PayPal email, and then that way we can sort everything out. There we go. Cool. Yes, it's yeah. I think it's it's already being packed there, Richard. I know you just you just uh, sorted it out, and it's it's going to be gone in a minute. I told you I had to fight with the uh, post guy yesterday. It was crazy. All right, so here we go. <clears throat> we got. 15 on the Stang, and we got six on the Classic. Awesome. Thanks, Chris. Awesome. Appreciate that. All right. Let's sell this cool Classic first. Let's put the clock on the cool Classic first. In the meantime, let's get it rolling. And I think you guys want to do a, I got a drag truck up there if you guys are interested. I'm not sure. We'll see. Let's put that in this more centered there. Sorry about that. Uh, Johnny on thinks he's out. He's been knocked out for years. No, joking, Johnny. <laughs> oh my. It's a shock when you're in. That's what's shocking. My brother always asks me to take a screenshot. <laughs> Johnny Hans in. <laughs> so there we go. 25 seconds left on the clock. And it looks like uh, Wayne Farr has got this one at six bucks. Wow, that's a steal for that one. That's a good little deal. Yes, for drag trucks. <laughs> he's laughing. All right. Cool. One time I'll actually post me playing something so you guys actually hear what I sound like. Seven, Russell Weichel jumps in. Five seconds left on the clock. Russell Weichel jumps in for seven bucks. Russell, I have to admit, we got a new clock going. Russell Weichel has been with us since the beginning, like a lot of you guys, actually. And uh, some of the newcomers, they, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's growing here at Diecast TV. Hopefully we'll grow a little bit bigger. Wayne Farr says eight on the classics. Thank you about that. We'll put a new clock up there. Boom, baby. New clock. All right, so there we go. Eights, eights on the classics right now from Wayne Farr. Don't forget about Chris Peters. He's got the 15 on the black wall, and that's carded there. Oh, it's probably in another one. <laughs> Firebird. It should be coming. 
I'll check there, Brown Boy. All righty, here we go. We got we got uh, 25 seconds left on Wayne Farr. All right, 20 seconds. Sometimes the things get in different boxes, especially if you got many boxes coming to it. Yeah, we know we'll put them all in the, try to keep them coming. 10, 9, 8, 7. No problem there, Brumlin. 9, says Russell Weichel. Comes in. Uh, we got to reset that clock. And 9 comes in to Russell Weichel on that cool classics for Torino. Flames are awesome on that. Pretty cool looking. <clears throat> so Russell Weichel's got it for 9 right now. And you got 35 seconds. Russell will make up the paperwork. All right. Here we go. Let's see. We got, I got a couple match boxes for you guys next. All right. <clears throat> Here we go. 19 seconds left. Let's say you there, Wayne. <clears throat> Just waiting on Wayne. 10 on the classics. New clock on there. 10 on the classics. Wayne, reset the clock. So that's how that works. Okay. I get it now. I get. I see why my brother does that. I understand now. <laughs> Don't like cars with flames. Richard Flame. Wow. All right. Russell Weichel says he's out. So we'll just let the old clock tick her down. Well, some guys like the flames. Some guys don't. I kind of like the flames. I like when they're ghost flames. When you can just sort of make them out. And they're like, yeah. Cool looking. I do like skulls too on them. Well, that's when it's, uh, you know, matte black or something like that. And it's got ghost flames. Those are cool. All right. Here we go. <laughs> All right, here we go. Nine seconds left. Looks like Russell Weichel's out, and Wayne Farr's got it at 10. It's going to be sold, 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 sold. No, he says, Richard Flames, not at all. Doesn't like Flames. Get them Flames out of here, he says. I usually say that when the Calgary Flames are in town. Yeah, they get them Flames out of here. <laughs> That's what when I say, get the Flames out of here. All right, so <clears throat> we're on the black wall. We got Chris Peters is on that one. And he's got it for 15 on there. All right, let's put this one in here for now, okay? I think this might stand on its own. Might. All right, so let's just take a look. We got uh, on the black wall there, it's a carded one. It's still in the blister pack, but it's a rough card. The card, it's, I'm telling you right now, it's extremely rough. <clears throat> but I kept it in there because it's going to be mint that way that when you open it up, and it's pretty cool. All right, so Chris Peters, put a clock on this one. Let's put the clock on this one. And let's get it rolling. Okay. I don't think you have anybody coming in because other, otherwise people would have jumped in on you. 15 bucks right now on that Mustang convertible. All right. Pretty cool. I've already got the paperwork written out. We've got 40 seconds left. And in the meantime, we'll set up the next in the next showroom in the, in the garage there. Okay. So right now, let's tick this one down. 30 seconds. Here we go. Alrighty, that was pretty cool. I got some slot cars, <laughs> Richard Flam. That's a great idea. I think I'll get to get more slot cars. <laughs> I think we got to get into slot cars, guys. I think everybody's got to get tracks, and we got to start racing. <laughs> Mike is shaking his head. Yep, we need that in the office. <laughs> we need slot cars. That's how we'll deliver notes to each other. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's gonna be sold to Chris Peters. Fifteen macaronis. You got it, Chris. Sold, sold, sold. Fifteen. There you go. Cool stuff. All right. All right. Hopefully, we'll get, there we go. Cool stuff. We'll put it over here. In the meantime, he says, I'll trade you. All right, cool. No problem. Sizzlers. I've been looking for Sizzlers for a while. I had a bunch of people ask me for Sizzlers. I've been, I've been looking around for them for sure. So this particular one, I think, is a 64 Ford. Check this out. It's like, it's an old, old Ford. Let me take a look at this thing. What I like about these castings, take a look. Ford Fairlane wagon. And what's so cool about matchboxes? They're super detailed, and I had a I had, we I was to talk about John uh, John R. Bennett knows the matchboxes really well, and he's the one got me hooked on these things. They're really cool detail. Look at I mean look at the hubs and look at the lines on this car. It's all old school, pretty cool. And the skyline I'll put up there next there, Tyro, no problem. I just wanted to get the old uh, get some matchbox in there. All right, so a little bit of a wagon on that one. So let's get any kind of bid. Let's, I should get this bid at least starting at least about three bucks. So just to get this thing rolling here. This is it's pretty nice. Mr. Stone is in the house. 
<laughs> I think Americans is backwards. <laughs> yeah, they're going the wrong. They're going the wrong way. Three. Thank you, Damian Harris, on the Matchbox. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. It's pretty cool. I mean, I'm telling you right now, we're we're gonna be. I was thinking about getting some, uh, getting some uh, Matchboxes in as well. The back seat is facing out. Is that? I don't, I'm not, really, I'm, to be honest with you, I'm not familiar with Matchbox. I'm not sure. I can check, though. Let me see. This is on an international car, but I think all, I think most of the Matchbox stuff are international cars. But let me just take a look. Five says Richard Flem on this one. I can take a, let's take a little Vanna White on this one. I'm mean, taking a look at that. The detail is crazy on this. In the back. I'm telling you, it's pretty wicked. Top. Paints are nice. I love it. Let me take a close look. It's facing. I can't see inside. Hold on a sec. You know my eyes, guys. Sorry about this. I need some. I need some light on this. <laughs> Hold on. I'm gonna get my light on my on my phone. I think it is. It's facing outward, right? And facing the back. That's what you're asking. All right, so we got six Rick Appleton, so six on this one. Oh, sorry, it's staying on its own kind of thing. All right, pretty cool. Seven, Richard, seven. And Richard Flem says seven dollars. I'm telling you right now, the, the castings on these things are wicked. Yes, thank you, Richard says yes. It's awesome. And I got uh, any Volkswagen guys in the house? I got a Type 3 Fastback. It's pretty wicked, too. <laughs> these things are wicked. Rick Appleton says ten bucks on this one, on this uh, on this particular one. A little bit of Ford Fairlane action, sixty-four wagon, pretty cool. Richard Flem says twelve dollars on this one. Twelve dollars on the Ford, pretty cool. Rick Appleton says it's yours. We can put the clock on it quickly. Just put a little bit of a clock on it, fifty seconds. Just keep it like that, just to give all fairness and uh, as fairness as goes. And then let's go with, um, somebody asked me for some Plymouth Mopar Hot Wheels, Dodge Hot Wheels. So we're going to put in here the Hemi Barracuda, 1968. All right, we'll put that in the old showroom home there. In the meantime, in the meantime, 35 seconds left on the clock. Looks like Richard Flynn is going to take this one. Let me do the paperwork. All right, there we go. All right, looks like the YouTubers are a little bit quiet today. I know you guys are flipping back and forth all the time. <laughs> so here we go. Ten seconds left in a minute. Here we go. Ten seconds going down. Richard Flem has got this one. I do. I must admit the Matchbox stuff is really cool. So here we go. It's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. There we go. There's that Fairlane wagon out the door. Meantime, we got a little bit of Hemi Barracuda. On the cool classics, now in the showroom, all right? <clears throat> I'm flipping them back and forth, too. <laughs> I go back and forth. Flip, all right, in the meantime, too, that's going to go in there. And let me just take a close look at this. Opening doors. <laughs> you got to love that. Take a look at that one. And we got a couple things going on. So we got the 68 Hemi Cuda. Oh, yeah, it's awesome. You're welcome there, Richard. I'm telling you right now. Uh, the castings that they have on Matchbox are really, I love it because they do the realistic one. So this is a 1965 Volkswagen Type 3 Fastback I put in the front. Five on the Barracuda. All right, that's Damian Harris has got that one right now. Five bucks to open the bids on the Barracuda. And in the meantime, we got this Fastback. It's pretty cool. Volkswagen uh, Type 3 Fastback, 1965. Awesome. All right, air cool. I believe it's air cool. For sure. All right, here we go. Yeah, you did there, John. You missed a Ford, too. I put up a Ford. Ford Fairlane. Oh, man, these are so cool. All right, I got a, I got a couple more I'll put up in the meantime. <laughs> Six on the Cuda. There we go. Six on the Cuda. We got eight on it. That's right. They, and so we got ten right now. Three on the Volkswagen. I was just telling John that uh, you were the one that opened my eyes up to the Matchbox. They're wicked. All right, so here we go. Just to make sure that Darren, Chris, make sure you did uh, our uh, 
registered at diecasttv.com. It's important. Gilberto Cortez is five on the Volkswagen type. Okay, right now, he's got five on the Volkswagen. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm telling you right now. I'm watching my cars go on train display. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm just telling you right now, they're amazing how their casting are done. So right now we got five from Gilberto. He's got five on the Volkswagen. We got Dale Nelson's got 12 on the Cuda. All right, so there we go. That's where we're sitting right now. So make sure if you're new, just make sure diecasttv.com. Awesome, thank you very much. Appreciate it. And if you see anything you need or you want, let me know and I'll try to get it for you guys. All right, so 13 says uh, Aaron. Am I saying your name right? Aaron? Aaron Curtis? 13 right now. There we go. Dale Nelson says 15 on the CUDA. So let's put a clock on the CUDA. Let's get it rolling. All right. Let's get the going here. Let's get her going. So 15 on the CUDA. Aaron says that. All right. So right now, Dale Nelson's on the 15 on the CUDA. We got 49 seconds left. <laughs> I just looked up when it was one second off the clock. All right, so let me pay, make the paperwork. All right, cool. 17, says David Weiss on the CUDA. Yeah, you were the one asking me, weren't you, David? He's, he's trying to Skype, uh, snipe in there. He got we reset the clock. 17 on the CUDA. David Weiss. I'm going to make the paperwork. Dale says it's out. Going once then to David Weiss. All right. In the meantime, we got the Volkswagen. We'll put that up in a minute. The fast pack is pretty cool. More par man, David. Yeah, I think he does. I got a couple more par guys, which is cool. I'm thinking that Mopar, Mopar power, more power, more power, no par. <laughs> so who said that? Mopar, no par. Some of those guys. Funny. All right, here we go. Seven seconds left. Here we go. Going on the clock. It's going to go, here we go, here we go. David Weiss, I think you got it for 17 Smackaroonies. And it's sold, sold, sold. Came in sniping, and he picked that one off. All right, there we go, David Weiss. All right, there we go. Meantime, the fastback, let's take a look at this. It's pretty cool, all right? Let me just take a little bit of a uh, Vanna White for you guys on this one. It's pretty cool looking. Let's take a look at the top, so it's got that, you can see it there. The hubs are like exactly like they're supposed to be. Never, never heard of them. We got John R. Bennett making wise cracks on YouTube. Man, look at that thing. That's pretty cool. Let me straighten it out. <laughs> Mopar no car. That's what it is. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> Mike, Mike's a Mopar guy, too. I believe. Am I not right? Mike? All right, so here we go. Matchbox, pretty nice looking. The paint is nice on it. Pretty cool. All right, let's see what else we got in here. Let's see what else we can put in. Something interesting. Let's do something different. Hmm. Hmm. Couple things. Let's see. Have Flintstone cartoon cars. Flintstone cartoon cars. We had, I think, but I, I think they got all sold. Let me just double check. Looking on my board here. No, I can't. I, I can't sell. He's trying to get stuff out of my personal stuff. What is that? He's going to take it on. He's going to take the car out of my daughter's hands. What's up with that? I had one uh, Flintstone. I had, the, you know, I had the Fred Flintstone's car. But I only got one of those yet, so I'll get another one later. In the meantime, let's do something else here. All right. Let me put one of these guys over here. So anybody on the Volkswagen? Do we have any bids on the Volkswagen? I can't remember. Can we just take a close look at it? We're just going to re go back a bit. Sorry about that. Yep, we did. We had five on um, Gerberto Cortez. That's five. Sorry, my mistake. Yeah. That's what they do sometimes, though, Richard. They go into my private stock. <laughs> I don't mind. I keep the I keep the really good stuff in my house. <laughs> you want me to put up a super? This They had supers. These supers went earlier, but if you want me to put one up. I've got the door slammer and the carbonic. I can put them up if you like. All right. In the meantime, let's sell off. Uh, let's sell off the Volkswagen Type Three Fastback. All right. Let's put a clock on that Volkswagen. 
Let's get it rolling. There we go. We got the clock on it. Just a second. There we go. Boom, baby. It's starting. Pretty cool looking Volkswagen Fastback Type 3. 65, 1965 Volkswagen. You know, I'm always after Carmen Gears. You want some sugar on it? You want some sugar? I got no sugar on that. I was doing it one at a time. Oh, I see what I could have done, though. Oh, well. <laughs> Can't put sugar on it now. Six on the Volkswagen. Six says Wayne Farr on the Volkswagen. All right. All right, here we go. You guys want some sugar on this. Hold on a sec. All right, hold on, Gilberto. Hold on a sec. Sugar, I found something. See, I like to keep it in the, in the theme of Volkswagen. So here we go. Oh, see, he wants this New York PD match. Well, I'll see what I can do. Oh, I'll see if I do have something. I have a Volks Volkswagen Transporter cab. It looks like almost like a T1 type, but let's take a look. 10 on the Super Harvey. He's already bitten on the Super. Wait a sec. Wait a sec, Harvey. Wait. I got to get through these first. All right. So I'm going to put in a little sugar. Oh, that's not in the picture there. Hold on properly. Hold on. Let me do this. Like that. That's better, right? Or maybe move it up a bit. I'm back. Okay, good. So that's the second one. So we'll put two in there, but we need to get six dollars on Volkswagen. So let's get another bit on that one. Come on now, a little bit of sugar on that. Come on, they're awesome looking. Harvey, I'll get to the super in a minute. I don't know which one you want. But <laughs> that's the other thing. <laughs> Harvey doesn't matter. He doesn't care. Like he wants one of the supers to go up there. And of course, this has the trailer hitch and all. <laughs> you can. When I like that, they do. Uh, Matchbox does do. The, it does have the trailers and stuff. It's pretty cool. All right, so here we go. We got two things going on here. We got two Volkswagens. Right now, they're waiting for the two Volkswagens are at $6. Now, Gilberto, you asked for some sugar. So I put some sugar down. So please. So let's get it going here. Whoops, I thought you were, we were bidding on the drag truck. Sorry, I'm at work. <laughs> I'm so sorry. What are you talking about? I know you want 10 on the Supers, but hold on a sec. Right now, we got six on the Volkswagens. Six on the two Volkswagens. Come on, guys. That was a little bit of sugar I added on there. Now I got no, now I got no bids. What's up with that? Oh, really? That's interesting. Interesting tips, tidbits of information. It says, I'm not sure about the U.S., but Matchbox is 25 cents cheaper than Hotwoods in Canada. And then there's 50 cents more the Smashbox are 50 cents more in the Australia. That's crazy. All right, let's we'll get the talk clock. The reason I haven't put a clock on it because my producer's not in his seat. <laughs> he did have to go for a second. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Put a clock on the Volkswagens. That's for the pair of Volkswagens for $3 or $6. So $3 a car. Come on, guys. I'm trying to keep it moving. Sorry about that. We had it was only two of us here, Damien, so we're kind of just juggling things. Usually when my brother's here, he's got three people. I'm the one running around doing stuff, and they got guys behind the camera sitting around can follow stuff more easier. All right, so no Matchbox. Austin Munson says no Matchbox. Okay, we tried it. it was at, Damien Harris asked me to put some Matchbox, so I put some Matchbox up. That's the only reason I did. All right, so, and it, actually, some people like Matchbox. It's one of those. got to cater to everybody. Trying to. All right. Catch you later there, Richard. Thanks for your bids and all that stuff. All right, so far. Nine seconds left here. We're going to get a sell them off. Look like Wayne's got this one. Sold, sold, sold. He's got the two. See that? You asked for sugar and you didn't take it. And it became six bucks for the two. All right, there we go. Well, what to do? Fair enough. Fair is fair. All right, so there we go. All right, let's get <laughs> VW's ugly. I like VW's. What are you talking about? <laughs> All right, so let's take a look. I got a Roger Dodger in blue, in that light blue, in the uh, showroom. So we got that there. There we go. All right. And Harvey wants one of these supers. Okay, I'll put up a super. He's sort of got the bid on it, 10 bucks. It's got the real riders on this one. Look at this one. This is the Nitro Door Slammer. Oh, yes, this is a super. I've got some door slammers. Oh, that's why this thing looks so familiar. 
All right, so we got 10 on the Roger Dodger. And that was originally by uh, Robert Lewis got the first bid in. Ro Roger, uh, Robert, or sorry, Roger, uh, Robert Lewis. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm getting my tongue twisted there. All right, so we got, let's do this right. We got Ro Robert Lewis at $10 on YouTube. And so he was the first bid at 10 bucks. Aaron Curtis comes in at $12. <laughs> West side. And then we got Damien Harris, $12 on the slammer. So we got 12 and 12. So we got uh, 12 on the Roger Dodger, 15 on the Roger Dodger by Dale Nelson. Here we go. There we go. Roger Dodger, $15, Dale Nelson. $12 on the slammer. Don't get caught in the slammer. <laughs> All right, here we go. That's right. That's right. And Robert Strong says, here we go. He starts laughing. So Dale's got the Roger Dodger at 15 right now, and we got Damian Harris at 12 on the slammer. So let's put the clock on it. I'll get things rolling a little faster for you guys. Sorry about that. 15 bucks on the Roger Dodger, and we'll put a clock on that bad boy. And here we go, hopefully. Here we go. There we go. Cool. It's on. It's on. 13 on the slammer. So we're keeping the slammer going. In the meantime, we're looking at the Roger Dodgers selling off. Right now, Dale Harris has got it for 15 smackaronis. All right, so that's where we're sitting right now. We got 35 seconds on that Roger Dodger, and it's going to be sold. There we go. <clears throat> All right, let's get her going here. We got Roger Dodger at 15 bucks. 25 $16, Aaron Curtis. I believe that's on the Roger Dodger. I believe that's what you're on. Yep, thank you, Artie. Understood. Got a new clock going. Pretty cool. All right, so we got 40 seconds now on the clock. And there we go. 35, 34. All right, there we go. Cool stuff. Let's get it rolling here. All righty, we got 18. Sorry, Dale Nelson. It's 18 on the Roger Dodger. You like these classics for sure. I know, Dale. I see that. 18, new clock, new clock, new clock. Let's get a new clock going. There we go. 15, 50 seconds on. There we go. New clock. Dale Nelson's 18, Roger Dodger. That's where we're at right now. That's the recap. What do we got here? 19, Robert Strawn on YouTube has put a $19 bid on. $19. Aaron Kerr says he's up. No problem. That's why I like this auction. It's kind of cool. It's like auctioning off stuff. It's pretty cool. We got 35 seconds on the clock. We have Robert Strawn on YouTube has 19 for that Roger Dodger. And just waiting for Dale's saying go ahead or sell it or what's he want to do. Let's see here. We got 19 from Rob Strawn. And let's see here. I got to make the paperwork. Looks like I'm making paperwork. Let's see here. 20, says Dale Nelson, says 20 on the Roger Dodger. All right, so I got both of you guys going on there at it. 12, Dale Nelson says $20, a new clock is on, and he's on Facebook, says 20 bucks. Rob Strong, what say you? Now I'm waiting for Rob's answer. I'm not sure if you have this color on this blue one. I've got a few different colors of them, but there we go. Right now, Dale Nelson's got this one for 20 bucks. $20 right now for Roger Dodger. This is my brother's favorite casting. It's $19. Here you go. Oh, Team Facebook. Team Facebook is in. That's right. My brother got Team Facebook and Team YouTube. <laughs> it's like tug of war, but Team YouTube's got like 10 watches right now. And we got like 14 on the other one. So there we go. Looks like it's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. You got it there, Dale. 20 bucks. You got it. I think that one the other day went up to like 50 bucks or something crazy like that. All right, so here I am in the wrong. There we go. So there we go. Here we go. All right, so we're on the super right now. I think the super was at, oh my goodness, remember my memory is going to jog here. I think it was 13 bucks or something like that. Or 15, I can't remember. Let's just go back. 13 on the slammer. That's right. So I thought something like that. Okay, 13 and Harvey had it. 13. And Harvey's got it on the super. Super, super duper. One time we had so many supers I could do a whole Sunday of supers. And we did the whole Sunday of supers. <laughs> we really did. 14 on the slammer, says Damien Harris. As long as it doesn't get you in the slammer, 
Get the summer. <laughs> Hell of a deal. All right, Raul Richardson. <laughs> he says, Hell of a deal. All right. All right, there you go. The Nitro Door Slammer. I have a couple of Door Slammers from the old school ones. Harvey Mayan is in at 15 bucks on the Door Slammer. So let's get a clock on that Door Slammer. Let's get things rolling. I know that's how we got to do this. All right, so 16 says Wayne Farr on the Slammer. Dale, you came in a little bit later than uh, Harvey there. 17, Damian Harris says. Put a new clock. Put it on the clock. We're ticking away. So here we go. 17 on the Slammer. It's a slammer away. Now, I, don't forget, I got the whole set of treasure hunts from 2007, which was the first year they did the Supers. And I've got, you know, the Enzo Ferrari. Yeah, that's in that set, too, which is pretty sweet. I got the whole sealed set. It's coming. Hopefully, it'll be here Saturday. That's what I'm telling you now. Tune in on Sunday. <laughs> Look forward to that one. All right, so it's got 20 seconds left. Damian Harris has got it for 17 smackaroonies. Here we go. 18 says Dale Nelson. Let's start the new clock. Here we go. The clock is ticking. Dale Nelson's on at 18 bucks. Oh, he's getting smart. Damian Harris is in the other side on YouTube at $20. He's getting cheeky. Cheeky. He's on YouTube at 20 bucks. <laughs> That's right. This David, David, it did come from the David collection. That's right. Right now, the super is at $20. And Damian Harris switched over to the YouTube side, Dale, just so you know. He's trying to be cheeky. Oh, and his name's pretty funny. It says, don't think before you speak. <laughs> oh, my goodness. There you go. 25 seconds on the clock. It's at 20 bucks right now. It's Damian Harris has got it. He's on YouTube. He's flipped over. <laughs> you guys crack me up when you flip over. I got to keep track of you guys. All right, here we go. Now you're making things difficult. What is all we did there? 22 says Dale Nelson. 22 says Dale Nelson. New clock is in house. Dale Nelson's got it at 22 bucks. Here we go. This is kind of fun with the clock. I get, I get why the clock is there. <laughs> I get. I like the 50 second clock. It's cool. All right. I see what's happening. See so you guys. You guys are floating in and out of the two 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 platforms. It's funny. All right, here we go. Oh, Dave. Damien says he's out on YouTube. Dale Nelson, it looks like you got this one now. Unless anybody else take us jumping in. I think you're home free, I think, Dale and Dale. You got a little bit of a deal there, too. That's pretty cool. Hard to find those supers. Ten seconds left in a second. Here we go. We got six. Here we go. Five, counting it down. Three, two, one. Now you got it. Sold, sold, sold. Uh, Nail Nelson got it for 22 bucks. All right, good job. All right. No, I left myself hanging dry there. Hold on a sec. I didn't put anything in the door. Hold on. Let's get in here. Let's get in here. Okay, so let's put that. Now I'm going to put that in a protector here. Hold on a sec. And I promised, I promised the Skyline to come up. This is a 1971 Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR C10. Beautiful. And the JDM tuners. So we're going to put this one up. Uh, yeah, this one in there. So we'll get that in the front there just to get that going there. And I know Mike's just come over to help me, but he's putting it in there. Oh, wow, you paid 25 for that. See, it all depends on who's bidding. That's the thing. Love the clock, Dale says. <laughs> it's pretty cool, actually. It's, an, it's a pretty cool concept. Now I want to get like a <clears throat> sound, like a honk sound or something like that. You know, a racing sound or something for the soul sound. I don't know. I got to get more sound uh, sound effects in here. That's what I need. All right. So let's see what we're going to put in the showroom. I want to make sure I got something cool in the showroom. I could definitely do that. Okay. I think that's what we'll do. Five says uh, Harvey on the JDM tuners. All right. Let's get it rolling. And we got an opening bid at five bucks. It's starting the way. That's the way to work that one. All right. So. Let's see what I got here. What time is it? Around 10 o'clock. Let's see how many guys we got in the room. Not too much. I was going to put some of those, the drag truck in there, but if I don't have too many people, it's not so interesting. I have two of them here, by the way. I have another Thunderbirds VW bus, by the way. Any more supers, David Weiss says. <laughs> yeah, I do. Garage car time. Garage car time. Hold on. Let's see what I can do. It's funny, this one set I got, I got a bunch of the same ones. I don't want to keep putting the same garage car up. The La Sabra, the Soul Fly, 34. Oh my goodness, hold on a sec. Eight on the skyline from Tyrone Dark. Thank you, Tyrone. Okay. 
Okay, hold on a second. Just throwing stuff around. I don't know where we are. Got eight on the skyline right now. Let's see what else we got here. Any red lines? Not right now. I don't have. I didn't. You know what? I don't have any red lines right now. I ordered. I bought some, but I've been waiting for them for the guy to actually send them, and then of course you gotta wait for the USPS guy to show up. And when that when you got them working on uh, together, and they finally show up. All right, let's see what I got here. I'll put something up. I got a chase piece here. We got $9 for Justin Under. He comes in and on the Nissan at $9. Thank you for that. He's on YouTube side of things. In the meantime, I'm trying to fish out some, something really cool for the showroom here. All right. Okay. Love it when work slows down. So we got not, Justin Under has got it for $9 right now. On the skyline. It's got nine bucks on the skyline. It's hard to get those uh, red lines from people because they don't always want to sell them, you know? They want to keep those things. Ten, says Damian Harris on the Nissan Skyline. Now, that Nissan Skyline is pretty cool. The Jada toy, they, they make a pretty cool, cool car casting. I do want to get more into all the different types. I think I'm, I'm going to try to get some M2s and try to get all that kind of stuff as well. Twelve on the skyline, says Tyron Dark. 12 on the skyline says Tyrone Dark. All righty, there we go. Let's see here. Any red lines available? Not Mel right now, I don't have yet. Like I was telling everybody, I got, I've, I've got some, bought some, but I'm waiting for the guy to actually pack them and then send them. And, you know, it's one of those kind of things. So I'm not sure. I got to check the tracking on it. I have to see when they're coming arriving. I do know about my uh, about the drag buses. I got 29 drag buses coming in here. It should be here. It says, Ross, you need to host more. <laughs> okay, thanks. I'll, I'll try, but the problem is I'm trying to, we're trying to duplicate this so that I can have somebody doing the track. Like right now, we got nobody to log anything. I have to do all the logging after the show, <laughs> which is, which is going to be a kind of a pain, but what to do? It's one of those things. When there's a duo here, it's kind of tough. All right. I'm having fine funding, finding red lines at swap. Yeah, that's I gotta go to more swap meets. But if I go to more swap meets, I can't be here. <laughs> Any Datsuns? Justin Under says Datsuns. You know, I got one. I got like a mainline Datsun. Hold on a sec. You know me. I want to get some cool stuff up. I don't want to just. You know. Let's see what I got. I'll see. I can put something in there. Hold on a sec. All right. You gotta love that, Robert. Awesome. You got to come down here. Somebody's got to come here and help me buy some stuff like that. <laughs> go to go to the shows and, you know, do that kind of stuff and help us. I'd love that. All right, so here we go. We're going to put the clock on this thing. Let's get it. Let's stop the talking and let's do some selling. All righty. So let's get some things going here. Let's see what I got. All right. I appreciate that, David. I'm also in the, and I got also set up stuff, so I'm trying to get all that kind of stuff. Booking a flight, John Arben's coming. No, I got more black walls. I, you know what? I just, I got carried away with all the other stuff in there, Jeff. I, I'll put some more black walls in there for you, okay? Let's see what else I got. All right, so we got 12 on the skyline right now, 22 seconds left. <laughs> Pay for my plane ticket, and I'm there. Okay, I might take you up on that. Oh, let me check. 13 seconds left on the skyline. And we're at Tyrone Dark's got it for 12 bucks. Oh, I'd love it. If anybody could come down here, it'd be great. Or even any of the local cats. 13, new clock. 13, just in time. He just beat the clock. Skyline came in. Uh, Wayne Farr came in at 13 on the skyline. So there we are, 13. You do know you're bidding against your... Oh, Wayne Farr, well, you know you're in Tasmania. Uh, Tasmania, a uh, different country. Sorry about that. Still down under, but really under. <laughs> 32, 30 seconds left on the Nissan Skyline. Here we go. Tyrone says he's out. He's in. He's in. He's out. All right, so there you go. Wayne Farr jumped in on the last second there. He just had it. I saw I was watching the clock. It's good it turns red because I can see it. All right, so Wayne. Looks like Wayne Farr. And the last minute bidders. I'm looking at the, I'm looking at the boards. I'm looking at the boards. Just eight seconds left. I was waiting there, waiting there. 
And it's going to be sold, sold, now. Sold, sold, sold. That's the way that one grows. All right, so we got that one. We got In the meantime, I got a So Fine in the Larry's Garage in the actually showroom there. And that one is actually a chase piece, that's so fine. That's the uh, different one. It's got the little uh, initials on the bottom of it. All right. And in the meantime, in the garage, I can uh, I'll put some of this stuff. I'll set the garage up. Don't put it there yet. Well, I'll just set it up. So we'll get those things in there. Okay. Yeah, I do. I've You know how many? I've scoured it already, David. <laughs> I scour it every day. I'm searching. So I'm, I'm the buyer, right? So the problem with that is when you're the buyer, you're constantly looking for cars. Constantly. Big collections, all that kind of stuff. And sometimes, you know, you got you also got to buy them right, too. Because some of the guys think, you know, they got uh, they got gold on there. It's not really that much gold, you know, that kind of thing. So it's one of those. So right now we're looking at the So Fine Chase piece number 15 of 20, Larry's Garage. That's in the showroom. And if you want to flip over to the, uh, let's flip over to the other side. I've got a couple mainline Datsuns, and I put the, you know, the, of course, the Fair Lady, of, of course, we'll put that in there, too. I just put that in there for a little JDM. And maybe I'll add one more. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if I got something here. I'll add in. Let me just take a close look. All right, eight on the Larrys right now. That's what it is. Which, uh, I got two drag trucks there, David. I'm not sure if you noticed. I've got an M&D Toys, uh, one of the um, Blue Angels ones, too. Oh, you need the other color. Okay, we'll see. Five on the Datsuns from Tyrone Dark. Thank you very much. Sniper King. Who's Sniper King? God, Jeff Lang says two on the Datsuns, but it's already at five. Right now, it's at five. Tyrone Dark has it. No, it's the ship, Ugg. <laughs> okay, no problem. Right now, Justin Under says 10 bucks on the Datsuns. $10 on the Datsuns. He likes that bluebird. That bluebird is wicked. All right. <laughs> Super. Oh, I just noticed that Sniper King is. <laughs> You're cracking me up. Oi, oi, oi. Ozzy, Ozzy, Ozzy. Oi, oi, oi. Yeah. In Dubai, we used saying that on, of course, on Aussies National Day, we used to party a lot with the Aussies. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, the mailing he says, oh, we'll see about that. Not 20. 20 is not going to start. You got to start a little bit higher than that. Want some more sugar on the lot? Okay. Well, right now we got Wayne Farr at $8, I think. He's on the Larry's, right? But that's a, that's a chase, Larry's, just so you know. Oh, you want some 118s? Oh, Wayne, yeah, I know. You got those 118s. I had those cool ones, man. Those, oh, that was awesome. But uh, let's see, got a moment out of for sure. No, I don't think I do. Let me just quick gander. I seen one in my stuff, but I can't. You know what? I don't know where it is. <laughs> Close up on the five ten. Absolutely. Twenty five down. <laughs> you want the? All right, David. Just wait a sec. I mean, you gotta be. You gotta have some patience here. Hold on a sec. I'll do like one of these. Is that better? All right. I'll do one of these. Got the roll cage. Pretty cool. Uh, yes, it is. I'm ans answering David Weiss's question. Pretty cool. That, that's that's pretty sick. I see why people collect this one. It's pretty nice. There you go. There you go. All right. Cool. There you go. So we're on both there. Okay, so there we go. Right now, it's uh, Justin Under has it, I believe, at ten bucks. Ten bucks. <laughs> ten bucks. Justin uh, Justin Under has got it, I believe. Just double check there if my from you might just gonna flip it back there. Yeah. Okay. Ten bucks. That's where it is. All right. So there we go. You're welcome there, Tom. Justin, let's put a clock. You want to put a clock on this or what? Yeah, let's put a clock on the on the dance dance and the JDMs. The fair lady's kind of cool too. I should get some customs made. Twelve on the dance and says uh, Damien. Uh, sorry, Tyrone Dark came first, and then Damien. You guys came at the same time. Damien Harris says fourteen dollars. Okay, fourteen dollars. We got a clock on it. There we go. Let's get the clock. The clock solves everything. I'm telling, you, it's black and white. Tyrone Dark says fifteen. New clock. Let's get a new clock. All right, there you go. 
handles. 15, Justin Under says, but it's already Tyrone Dark took it on 50. Damian Harris says 16. Oh, start a new clock. <laughs> the clock is funny. All right, here we go. It's added a new dimension to the show, this clock. I have to admit. 18, Tyrone Dark. Oh, he's not, he's not backing down. $18, Tyrone Dark. All right, I'll, I'll talk to you about that, David. Maybe I'll give you a call. I got 18 Tyrone Darks. I got 18 Justin. Just before, actually, Steve. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Oh, so now it's Damian Harris being cheeky on you, Tyrone. He's on the YouTube side and says $19. Ay, yay, ay. This is going to start a feud in Austria, Australia. Oh, no. The boys from down under are going at it. And so is Justin. Justin Under. Just a, he's got the under in his in his name. <laughs> but they're all they're all in the unders. All right, so here we go. We got uh, Damian Harris said nineteen Tyrone Dark, and he's got twenty seconds. And then Tyrone Dark takes it to twenty. So there you go. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Tyrone Dark. That's where it's sitting right now. Justin Under says no. Oh, of course, a new clock because of course on the YouTube Damian Harris goes to twenty one. Oh my, what am I going to do with you guys? Yeah, bluebirds, I'm telling you right now, that bluebird, I can't keep them. They're always, I know, they're always smoking hot. I got to get some custom bluebirds, if I can ever hold on to some. <laughs> right now, 21 is where it's at. Justin Under says he's out, and right now, Damian Harris has got 21, got 22 seconds left. Get your bids in. Out. Outish. <laughs> Outish. Tyrone Dark says. What does that mean? Oh, no. It's going to put me on edge. Oh, no. All right. 10, 9, 8. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, my. Here we go. It's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. 21. Damon Harris. Oh, my goodness. That was another little bit of a battle on this one. All right, here, hold on a sec. Here, let's get this going here. Damian Harris. Whew. You guys, Tyrone, you give me a heart attack, but I was waiting for you. <laughs> I was waiting for you to jump in. I was like, oh, no. This is going to be a last-minute bidder. All right, so we got 21 for those. All right, so let's put them aside. And I got that so fine. Oh, it's so far back, but I remember it was $8, and I believe Wayne Farr has got that so fine. Let me move that into the garage, okay? Let's do that for a second. I think that's it's way back there. Wayne Far and Larry's eight dollars on the Larry's. All right, so let's do this. Let's do this. I'm gonna do this. This one. Oh, I wish I wish David. I gotta keep. I gotta search for that stuff because that's not easy to get too. Guys that collect JDMs, they love their JDMs. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. David Weiss, you've been good, so good to us. You started the bid. You want this. You want this one. I know. And it's killer too. Dang. This is out of my private stock. Oh, my. Okay, here goes. Volkswagen drag truck. There you go. You had a $25 bid. That was respectable to start that off because you have to do that. When you do that, you can get the mail, and that's what it's going to cost you anyway. So there it is. There it is. My Volkswagen drag truck with the Hot Wheels. They had four of those in the collector's edition, and that's the drag truck, and that's one of my favorite castings. And right now, just and under, it's already at... $25, and that was what David Weiss has put in there. So just so you know, just under $25 is already on, and Damon, David Harris, uh, sorry, David Harris, David Weiss has put on $25. Bucks. Sorry, my tongue is a little... Damn, Damon Harris happens to put on $30 on it. So there you go. Now we know where this is going. All right. There we go. Very cool. I'm telling you, this is one of my favorites. I love, do love the drag trucks. And I love my drag buses, and I'll be I'll be crying when I have to sell off the 29 of them <laughs> that I got coming in. But John Bennett says he's out. He's never in on these anyway. Although he gave me an imprint of a bit of information that Volkswagen and uh, Ford are working together because they want more Volkswagen sales here, and he says that they're going to be building them for Volkswagen. The Ford will be born in Volkswagen. It's interesting, and vice versa in Europe. That's pretty cool. Interesting information. I don't know why you know that, John, but thank you very much. <laughs> Damien Harris, let's get the clock on this bad boy. <laughs> As my brother says. Oh, my goodness. What am I doing? 
I can't be imitating him now. Come on. All right, so here, let's get a clock. 50 seconds on the, uh, oh, let's do, oh, let's do, that's sorry. Let's sell off the Larrys first. We got Damian Harris at 30. It's there. It's marinating, as I like to say. Let it marinate. And then we go on to the so. Let's go on the so fine. Let's put the 50 second clock on that bad boy. And then David there says, thanks, David. All right, here go, here we go. So we got 44 seconds and we're on. Let's do this one. All right, let's get her on there. We got 40 seconds going on so fine. I think it's Wayne Farr's got this one. This is a chase. And if, uh, Dennis, you're looking for the other one, I think I have it here. I think you're talking about the yellow one, right? Yeah, it's the yellow and blue one. All right, here we go. 20 seconds on this one. Wayne Farr putting the paperwork. Hold on a sec. All righty, here we go. Going to sell it so fine. Eight seconds left on it. Wayne Farr's got no competition for a Chase Larry's at $8. Wow. There you go. You got a deal. Sold, sold, sold. That was a steal and a half. Wayne Farr got that one. All right, so. Let's do this. All right, we're on the we're on there. We're on the bus. Oh, sorry, the truck. We've got a Volkswagen T1 truck. It's got there. It's in there right now, and the bid's at thirty dollars right now. <laughs> you keep looking at my buses. You gotta let me have something. <laughs> All right, I'll. It's um, M and M and D toys, and the other one is the Thunder Thunderbirds uh, VW. Also, very cool bus. Anyway. There you go. Uh, I bought every chase, <laughs> every chase the other night. Okay, no problem, David. All right, so here we go. Let's see what we got on. We got thirty dollars right now on the truck, drag truck. Anybody else? Let's put a clock on it. Let's put a clock on it. Put a clock on it. Let's get her going. Let's get her rolling. Get the things rolling here. There we go. Thank you very much, there, Damien. I saw you got you also got the uh, big set that yeah that every every uh, the other night yeah yeah he got the the ones with all the three designers in it and the best I love my favorite one is that Phil's a bus that's 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 the kicker in that one for me but there you go we got 28 seconds left on the clock Damian Harris 30 bucks on the truck T1 truck look at that you love the RLCs this collection stuff. Got alone. I'll have some more. Don't worry. More is coming. More is on the way. So, 35 on Dale Nelson says 35 on the drag. Well, it's a drag truck, but yeah, drag bus. I know exactly what you're talking about. The one on the screen. <laughs> All right. I know. You know how many times I was corrected that that's not a drag bus. It's a drag truck. Okay. Okay. I get it. Because the T1 truck. I get it. I understand. I figured it out now. I see how it's a little bit thinner than the other. I understand. I'm cool. 30 bucks. $30, $35 right now, drag truck, and it's at 30 seconds, and it's counting down. All right. Ooh, it's a little bit uh, a little antsy with this clock going on here, but I'm okay now. <laughs> I'm getting used to it now. All right. 36, says Damien Harris. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Hi Tyrone is on the other side of YouTube. He just switched. He's there because he knows there's less lag there. He's absolutely right. So Damien Harris is at $36 on the truck. All right. We're waiting there. We can see what's going on with Dale. We put, have to put a new clock. We put a new clock already. It's cool. 30 seconds. Oh, we go. 35 seconds. There we go. Nope, we're at 46 seconds. My mistake. <laughs> what happened? We put a new clock. That's why. 37. New clock. New clock. <laughs> that's right. New clock. 37. There we go. Dale. Woo. Dale. And look at that. Damien's being a gentleman again. Dale Nelson, you got it. 37. So let's just clock. Let the thing clock down. We have to start the clock. We put a new clock. We forgot the ticket down. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh, David Wee says you stayed out. Yeah, but you could have sniped it. You never know. So I got Tyrone on the other side. VK Grupa 3. Grupa 3. I know that because that's your, somehow it's... i seen that on your paper. All right, here we go. We got... Let me make the paperwork out. Dale Nelson. All right. There we go. All right, it's going once to Dale Nelson. Let me do the old school way, and I'm using the clock to time it. 
All right, any last-minute shakers, as my brother says, any last-minute shakers? Ten seconds left. Here we go. Oh, bid David if you want. That's David Weesey's talking about. We got a bunch of Ds on that side. <laughs> sold, sold, sold. Dale Nelson, sweet. Deal, you got my drag truck. Oh, I get one last look at it. It's pretty cool. That's all I got to say. That's all I got to say. It's pretty cool. It comes in the old Protecto, you know that. And there you go. All right, cool. So what are we doing? I put a so fine, I believe, the one Dennis Barr needs in the, in the garage. I, that's what he said. You need the other one. And that's the other one. All right, so let's take a look, see what's going on. See what he's saying. So we got to start the bids at least at 5 bucks on the Larrys. Let's get the thing 5 going. Let's get it rolling. Okay. In the meantime, I wanted to get some black walls out. I want to make sure Jeff Lang is happy. Wayne Farce is five on the legs. Thank you, Wayne. Starts the bidding. <laughs> five so fine. Well, five on the layer is already gotten there um, by uh, Wayne Farr there. He's got it just ahead of you. All right, so what am I going to do with the black walls? Let's see what I got here. Which, oh, this is pretty cool. Let's put this one up. It's an odd thing. The vet van. The vet van. Eight on the Larrys. Joe Moreso. Moreso. He's in the house. Welcome there, Joe. All right. So we got a little bit of Larry's action. So fine. Where's Dennis? Dennis Barr. Where's Dennis Barr? He's, this is the one he needs. <laughs> he said he needs this one. Oh, I can't. I can't keep you in the house. I can't keep you in the house. Nine on the Larrys, says Wayne Farr. Nine, says Wayne Farr. What's our YouTuber saying? So let's, uh, what else do I got? I got to get some Fords in the action in a minute. Let me prepare something while you guys are bidding. Bid amongst yourselves while I prepare. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Oh, the color, uh, what? Go it. Go it. <laughs> need the other color. Oh, you need the other color. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Three on the black wall. Wayne Farr. So we got the Vet Van Blackwall in the showroom. Just to give a little bit of introduction. All right, see, so what, what do we got here? Oh, I want to find some more force. No, you sold me the same one a couple of days back. <laughs> okay. That's not the one then. I don't know which one you want, the one you need. I figured that was the other one. All right, let's see. Green Rabbit. Oh, the Green Rabbit. It's That's back here. It's a okay. Oh, no, no. I talked about this one, I think. All right, we'll see. I, I do have a rabbit. Okay. All right, thank you. No problem. Thanks for shopping in. Dale, thanks a lot. So seven on the so fine right now and five on the black wall. Appreciate the bids there, Dale. Catch you later. We're on every day. If you're looking for something too, Dale, that you do specifically collect, please just inbox us and uh, I'll try to sort you out. I always try to get whatever everybody likes. Hopefully. I try to do my best. All right, so we got seven on the so Hold on. The so fine, though, I think is already higher. Let me just double check. So it was already at nine. Larry's, uh, Larry's is at nine right now. Wayne Farr. <laughs> my inner out. <laughs> That is not a question for me to answer there, Johnny. I don't want to know any further answer. And don't tell me anything else. I don't want to know. <laughs> oh, let's do this one. I want to do a little bit of forward action. All right, so there we go. We got five on the black wall. <laughs> There's not that much lag then, I think, on Facebook now. If you, got, you guys responded pretty quickly. That's pretty cool. So right now we got... Uh, Dave Weiss on the black at five on the vet van. Vet van. <laughs> it's really not vet. It's nice and dry. <laughs> oh, my. It's getting a little bit late here. You know, when, you, you know when you're working 14 hours a day, you get a little batty sometimes. <laughs> okay, let's see what's going on. Let's get back at it. All right, so we got eight, I think, on the Larry's, and that's by Wayne Farr. 
and I believe David Weiss is five on the black wall. I'm just waiting for Jeff Lang. Jeff Lang, come back. Jeff Lang, come back. Where are you? I've got a vet van. It's very vet. <laughs> it's very vet van. It's pretty cool, though. Nice and clean. Cool looking van. All right, there we go. All right. Have a good night there, Johnny Hahn. Johnny Hahn has left the building. Oh, he's leaving the building. He's coming back. No, tomorrow he's coming back. All right. So let's see what's cooking here. What's shaking? Uh, what's the bid on the black wall right now? It's five. David Weiss has it on five. You're the fellows, fellers that know that black walls. It's a vet van. Very vet. All right. So there we go. A <laughs> vet van is in the house. That's so funny. This is plugged in, yet it never charges enough. All right. So let's see here. Okay. Let's see here. Where are we at? Right now, the bid is at five on the black wall and eight on the so fine. So let's go with uh, clock on the so fine. <laughs> let's do that. It's clock on the so fine. So fine. The clock is ticking. There we go. Boom. Clicking. Real riders. Smoking rims, actually. Pretty cool looking. I have to admit. It's uh, eight bucks, eight smackaroonies on the Larry's. That's not the chase one. The other one was the chase, the other one. There must be a third variation. Tell me about that one, uh, Mr. Weiss. Or Mr. Schroeder, if you're looking. You're watching. All righty, let's get this thing rolling. We got 20 seconds left on the Larry's, and that was Wayne Farr, I believe. Let's take a double check on that one. Wayne Farr higher, there we go. Nine on the Larry's. Sorry, it was nine on the Larry's. My mistake. Nine on the Larry's. Wayne Farr had nine. It looks like it's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. You got it for nine smackaroonies. All right, there we go. Boom. Nine's done. Next. I know what I do need. I need some pads here. Well, I got some. Let me use up the old ones here. Okay, so. Let's see, what's the bid on the black wall? I already told you, so you're already cool with that. So right now the bid is on $5, and it's David Weiss. And let me see what I got here. In the meantime, okay. Let's do a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Okay. All right, so. Yeah, it could be. You got a lot of Larry's there, Dennis. <laughs> Actually, just inbox me what you need. Just do whatever. You know, just inbox me what you need. Then I'll get some. I'll try to get after them. That, oh, oh no. Now you're asking about my other drag bus. I'll get it up later. That's i got to save some drag buses until my other drag buses come in. <laughs> that's, that's, I told you what it is. It's the Thunderbirds. <laughs> Can you put out the other super, super, please? I haven't gotten that one today. Okay, I can do that. The carbonic. And let's go, let's sell off the black wall here first. So let's go right now. David Weiss has got the black wall five smackers. So let's put a clock on the black wall in the meantime. Okay, Dennis, but I'm Ross. <laughs> I know everybody mixes us up. Rick and Ross. I'm the Ross. Wayne Farr says he's out on the black wall. Okay. Dave Weiss says five. That's where we're at. And we got 26 seconds, 25 seconds. There we go. Yeah, I'm working on those kind of stuff. It's not easy to find that stuff. It's really, I mean, it's hard, first of all, to find cars in general, but yeah, it's one of those. You got that one. Yes. <laughs> Rick Ross is all the same. <laughs> he killed me. All right, here we go. Six, five, four, three, two. It's going to go. David Weiss is going to get the black wall. Sold, sold, sold. All right, so we got in a little bit in the garage now. We got a couple cheeky Fords in there. Well, Mercury and a Ford. And uh, we got there, the first of all, the Ford 40s Coupe in pink. 
All right, there you go. <laughs> I know, that's all right. It's all good. All right, so we got first one, the Hot Wheels Classic Series 2. I believe that was number 19 of 30. And it got six on the bid from the Mr. Tyrone Dark. And he is on YouTube. And there we go. Cool. And that's where I'm looking at right now. There you go. So that's where I'm at. So far, so good. We got six on the Classics. And I've got a little bit of a duo action in there. I put a Mercury and a Ford. You know, I like to keep it, uh, you know, like that kind of stuff. Because I know it, would be, it wouldn't be good if I mixed them up. I know. A little bit of beverage action. So the next one i got to put in there is you want the Carbonic. Okay, so we'll do that Carbonic in a minute. Seven on the Classic says John R. Bennett. And i got at Rick Appleton says 10 on the Ford. So let's take a close look at the Ford Coupe first. We'll get a nice close, close look at this one. I like the Spectre Flame on this bad boy. Let's get a little bit of pink action. I'll show you the top. It's pretty cool. The front is nice. Oops. oops. <laughs> the rear end is nice, too. Well, oh, that's kind of cool. Love that front end. It's pretty cool. These would be good to, to do a little custom job on, too. And then I'll swap them out in a minute so you can see the other one as well. Ten on the classics, but I think Rick Appleton's already got there, Wayne. And the Mr. Sniper King, it's got, okay, he's got 11 now. So that means uh, Robert uh, Strawn has got 11 on these, both of them. And I just want to switch them over so you can see the Merc. Mercury Cougar. It's a Cougar. All right, in green. Sorry, Richard Flynn, there's flames, I know. Sorry about that. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We got 11 on the on the... The pair of classics right now, and it's by <laughs> the Sniper King, which is also Dennis, uh, sorry, uh, Rob Strawn. Yeah, uh, it's, I'm telling you, that that pink Spectre Flame, I don't know what they did back then. It's wicked looking. Green is cool too. This green's nice too, but I like the, that pink is it's hot. So Wayne Farr says 12. $12, he's on the Facebook. And I think Tyrone also, you guys are all, they all, all the fellows from Down Under are in on this one right now. Uh, Tyrone, you came in a little bit late. Uh, Rick Appleton's jumping in at 13 on the Facebook team. Team Facebook. Rick Appleton's got it for 13 bucks. <laughs> I don't think I can talk any faster than that. All right, so here we go. Oh, yeah, I got to take a deep breath here. Hold on a sec. Okay, here we go. Rick Appleton's got 13 right now on the two classics. That's a steal, and they're cool. All Ford product. Right on there. I know JRB jumped in for a little smidge in there. Until the folks start jumping in. Rick Appleton's got this one for 13 smackers. Wayne Farr says he's out. Oh, there's one down. And we're just waiting for the Strawn, Mr. Strawn, and Mr. Dark. Mr. Strawn says $15. He's on the YouTube side, Rick. Just so you know, he's just put in a $15 bid. And if you guys want, you can check out on YouTube too. It's a little bit lesser lag than there is on Facebook. So just in case. So we got, and of course, Robert Strawn has changed his name to Sniper King. <laughs> uh, so let's get a clock on these things. Let's get a clock up there. We got Rob Strawn's got it for 15 bucks right now. We'll put the 50 second clock. Boom, baby. There it goes. All right, there we go. So far, that's what we got. We got Robert Strawn. He's got 15. All right, I think I'm going to put this ultra hot up. Let me think of Solaire ultra hot. Let me see what's going to happen here. Nice and clean. So, so you got the Sniper King. It's got, it looks like, 25 seconds left. Rick, what you saying? Right now, Rob Strawn's got it from Australia at 15 bucks. We're just waiting in there. We got 15 seconds left on the clock. Don't make me have a heart attack. Please come in as soon as possible. All right. I'm just going to remove that. Here we go. It's gonna, it looks like it's going to be sold. Sold, sold, sold. Rob Strawn, you are the Sniper King. He came in last second, picked them up. Boom, baby. 15 smackers. He's got them both. All right, there you go. $15. Lost my feet. Oh, no. He got, see, that Strawn's happy. He got, you got lucky, Strawn. Mr. Dark lost his feet. Oh, my goodness. Sorry. There we go. Hold on a sec. 
In the meantime, I put up a Solaire. It's got them ultra hot wheels kind of thing, black wall. It's pretty cool. Not black wall air, but it's uh, it's got the ultra hot wheels on that one. Pretty cool looking, and I I promise you guys, I put up the so the super, the other one, the carbonic. <coughs> So I'll put that one. In. I already had this one before, but I mean, yeah, I saw that, Damien. Actually, any of those messages, I actually read them. I can see them on my screen. <laughs> and it, what happens is it kind of blocks my screen. All right, so we got we got three bucks on the black wall. Jeff Lang is in on the ultra hot, on the Solaire. Solaire is cool. It's got that fin in the back. Is looking. It looks pretty wicked. And of course, that back back. Uh, lid opens up too the clip pops off or not pops off but opens up that's pretty cool so there you go we got a little bit of a super action in there i know i think uh who was asking me about that damien you were asking me about the super i'll put that up there carbonic you gotta start the bidding though let's start the bidding. at least 10 bucks let's get it get it in there ten dollars let's start it off it is a super treasure hunt let's just get it rolling here let's get it rolling if you need it there you go eleven dollars thank you damien appreciate that all right, that was uh, appreciated. All right, so pretty cool. Rubber wheels, of course, all that kind of stuff. Proper super. There we go. But do tune in because I will be getting super treasure hunts, and I'm going to have that. Uh, Mike Young is in at 10, but it's at already 11 right now, Mike. Damian Harris has it on Facebook at 11 bucks. Thanks for the bid, though, Mike. Appreciate it. And I saw your message earlier. And Wayne Farr says 15 on the treasure hunt. Thank you. Super treasure hunt, that is. There we go. We got that. I like how they do that TH when it's sort of hidden. It's kind of really cool. I like when they do it on the, when it's really hard to find. Yeah, nice super treasure hunt. It's pretty cool. So there we go. So yes, un, we will have some unowned bo un, un, sealed factory sealed boxes coming in. If you do want to order some, please just message us on the inbox and we will definitely sort you out. So Damien Harris is in at 18 on the super. Right now, it's at $18 on the Super. And they reassured us. It's funny because they said that every box has a treasure hunt in it. For sure it does. If you've been to Walmart and you've opened a box and you don't find it in it, it's because somebody has taken it out. Just so we know. we we, we I was like, no way, because I've seen it. I've seen sealed boxes. The guys were telling me sealed boxes don't have. And they actually do. They're all inside. They're, every, one, every box has one, they said. They reassured me. The sale, the uh, the rep, our local or not local rep, but the international rep, and the American rep for North America, he came and told us. He said, "No, no, every box has one." So that's uh, that's good information to know. So there you go. Damian Harris has got this one. Let's put the clock on the super treasure hunt. We're going down here. We're going down. Let's see what else we got. All right, let's see. We got 18 on. Damian Harris is on the super. Start the clock. You got to go in there. Let's get the clock a ticking. A clock a ticking. And let's see what else I got. Oh, this is pretty cool. Oh, my. Oh, this is pretty cool. I might do this one. We'll see. All right, only a few guys left. Oh, Wayne Farr says he's out. Thank you. 27 seconds left. Just waiting for Mike Young on the uh, YouTube side. Nine, <laughs> he came over to the Facebook side. Thanks, Mike. 19. It's easier for me to read, too, because you're all on the same page. Right? $19 on the Super. A new clock up there. It's already up there. It's already ticking down. There we go. 19 from Mike Young. Nice uh, nice little sniper in there, uh, Mr. Young. Clever. Clever jumping over. You got to watch out. Damien Harris will now jump over the YouTube I, if, I, if I know him correctly. We'll see. I know he wants this one. 26 seconds left. Let's get her in there. Get the bids in. Don't give me a heart attack. <laughs> Let's get the, the clock's going to give me a heart attack in a minute. All right, here we go. Let's get it rolling here. What do we got? Damien Harris says he's out. Wow, I thought you wanted this one. That treasure hunt is, I believe, 2016. 1516. The man from Edmonton. I've been up to, I've done, I've worked Klondike days. Sold, sold, sold. Anyway, in the meantime, Mike Young, you got it. All right. I believe, Mike, you're from uh, that way, aren't you? All right. 
I worked the Calgary Stampede and Klondike Days, all that kind of stuff. All right, so we got 19 Smackaroonies. You got it. We got the Black Wall in the meantime. Whew. I'll get that. I'll just put that over there. Oh, sorry. I put this in too. Sorry, my mistake. All right. Pacific Northwest. Yep. <laughs> there we go. All right, no, I'm talking about uh, Grossly. Grossly is a Canadian. I'm also a Canadian. Don't tell me you're an Oilers fan. Let me know that. 2015 Super Q case. All right, cool. Thank you, David. I love it when you guys help. I really And I also really super appreciate the help. It's pretty cool. So, we got a little bit of solar action, black wall. And right now, Jeff Lang's got the black wall at three bucks. I'm going to do a few more things, and I might call it an evening. Because i got to do all the, <laughs> all the darn invoices. <laughs> oh, yeah, the green rabbit. I'll do that after I solve the black wall. How's that? Nope to the Oilers. Thanks, Mike. I appreciate that. <laughs> my brother-in-law is an Oilers fan because he's from Edmonton. <laughs> oh, my. I'm a Lightning fan, though, and this year they're doing well. This is year. They do always do pretty good, but not uh, oh, super well. Let's get a clock on the black wall. Let's get that thing out of here. And grab it. So you guys want to... Oh, my goodness, grab it. <sighs> I've got a ton of logging to do. You guys are... Pushing my limit. I, Wayne, I'm going to have to save the Gravits to another day. Oh, I'm going to let my brother do that. I'm not very good at them anyway. Solar is going off. Let's put the clock up there. Let's get that thing out of here. All right, let's get the clock rolling. All right, there we go. Calgary all the way. I, I used to like Calgary when uh, Lanny McDonald was there. And he won the cup. I know my hockey. Definitely. Oh, you're in Lethbridge. Okay, cool. We used to do a couple of home shows and stuff down that way, Lethbridge. Oh, but you had to grab it. So I, I have to do it. I'm going to tell you guys I'm not feeling so good. Going to have to do it another day. That's the only thing. Jeff Lang, looks like you got this one easy in the bag. Let me just write this one out in the meantime. You like all them black walls there, Jeff. I'll try to get some more for you. And you got them at a pretty good price, too. Someone say grab it. No, no, no. Oh, Seattle, they get them back? Well, the golden. Oh, see. Four on the black wall. Alberto Cortez comes in at four just before the clock stops. Oh, my. You got a little bit of action there, Jeff. I thought it was on them in the bag. And Gilberto Cortez comes back with a four. Four dollar bit. All right, here we go. No voting, Joe. It's my health. <laughs> I do the show. I call the shots. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh. That's what kills me. Yeah, Jeff, he just jumped in. Gilberto just came in in the last minute. I was like, what? Uh, so it's at four right now, the black wall. Oh, yeah, yeah. You guys are going to give me a heart attack. Yeah, Gilberto got it right on the... He's giving the sign of a target with a dart in the... He's got it right in his bullseye. That's what he's done. Oh, he really... Okay, five on the black wall. Jeff Lang says five on the black wall. Now I'm waiting for Gilberto now. Now he's come out of the woodwork. He's come in and he's sniping again. Oh, you guys, you're going to give me a heart attack. All right, here we go. Jeff Lang's got five on the black wall. All right, here we go. We've got 35 seconds left on it. So, Gilberto, get your bid in as soon as you can. Six, he says, on the black wall. All right, now he's, now he's got it in there. Six, he's got it in there. <laughs> Thanks, Dennis. Appreciate that. So, he's got six on the black wall right now, Jeff. Six on it. That's pretty clean. Nice little ultra-hot wheels. Pretty cool. Solaire. Jeff says, Lang says he's out. Gilberto, looks like you're going to get it. All right, so we've got 30 seconds left on the black wall unless somebody else jumps in. I'm writing out the paperwork. Gilberto Cortez. I like Gilberto Cortez. He collects with his kids. I love that. I love when the father collects and the kids are really enthusiastic about it. It's an awesome hobby to do together like that. That's awesome. I always wish my son was around. But my, my daughter, too. The, my daughter collects as well. All right, here we go. Ready? It's going to be sold. Looks like sold, sold, sold. There you go. Your birthday is thanking me for that one. That's cool. It's wicked. It opens up. It's really nice, this one, too. Really nice and clean. All right, a little bit of ultra hots. Okay, so I put up a little matchbox. Let's see. It's a little 64 Pontiac Grand Prix. Thought it was cool. Put it in there. 
And I think, uh, all right. Yeah, the back hood flips open on that. On that on, oh, yeah, cool. <laughs> he killed me. Four on the purple, Damian Harris. It's pretty cool. I'm going to do a little bit of a showmanship on this one. Look at this. Doors open. Pretty cool. Oh, and the rabbit. That's what I'll do next, all right? I'll put it up in the showroom there. Just a second. Doing the old Vanna Wayne on this one. Pretty cool. If I could follow the camera. What's killing me is the camera stationary. I'm the one moving <laughs> it out of the way. Oh, Rick, I don't, you know what? I don't remember. <laughs> Somebody remind me if Rick got it or not. I can't remember. <laughs> That's okay. That's pretty cool. All right, so we got the, this rabbit. You want the rabbit, eh? The black, this matchbox, super fast rabbit. Can't see the date on this one. Looks like 78. On this one. All right, I'll put that up there as well. Three on the jet planes in the backyard. There's no. What are you talking about? Oh, really? I have the original one to this car. Very hard to find. Mine is in rough shape. Just a filler. Okay, cool. There we go. Three dollars on the rabbit. So we got the rabbit in there, and we got. Uh, a little bit on that. What was on the uh, Grand Prix? I forget now. <laughs> I think it was. A... You, Wayne Farr, you're not getting three dollars on my bus. Sorry, <laughs> no way that's gonna happen. Four dollars from Damien Harris was on the purple. Okay, so he's got. We actually got both of them. Damien Harris he got four and three. It's a Matchbox Jeff. Although the wheels are deceiving, aren't they? So we got five. David Weiss on the Rabbit. Five says that. That one's nice. All right, cool. The rabbit is a matchbox. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Waiting for his laugh. All right. So there we go. All right. So what we are, we're at five dollars on the rabbit, and I believe we are. Oh my goodness, I forgot. Fifteen on. No, oh, I'm not selling the drag bus today. That's gonna be another day. I know. I know. I know. After this one, if I, do I have a New York Police Department one? I, don't, I haven't looked yet. Hold on a second. Let me check. I got a few ones in here. You guys do like those. I gotta, I gotta, I, I'm going to cancel out here. Need the surfboards to the... Oh, yeah. Those are really hard on that rabbit. Trying to find stuff like that on the rabbit are not so easy. <laughs> but it's cool, that rabbit. I must admit. The rear door is open on it. On the rabbit, you say? Oh, what? No, I don't think. Oh, what are you talking about there, John? All right, so here we go. Where are we at on the bids? Let's see here. We got five dollars on the rabbit, I believe. David Weiss, and we got five four dollars on the purple. All right, so there we go. That's what I wanted to find out. Okay, so right now we got four dollars on the Matchbox uh, Grand Prix. And we got five dollars on the rabbit. So five dollars on the rabbit, and the five dollars was with Dave Weiss. And we got Damian Harris on the purple <laughs> at four. All right, so there we go. I made my little notes. Thank you very much. Gilberto Cortez is being cheeky by trying to open the bid on the drag butt, but no, I'm gonna have to stand my ground on that one. All right, so this is gonna be the last ones of the evening. So this is it. Let's put a clock on the purple. There we go. Pretty cool that '64 Pontiac. Looking pretty, looking pretty snazzy. All right, here we go. What happened? What happened? All right, let's get her going here. 34 seconds on the purple. 31, 30. There we go. 27, 25. Here we go. It's going down. Last uh, last uh, bits here. Damian Harris. He's got this one 14 seconds. No problem. Have a good night. <laughs> MR, he says, Mr. Ross. 
Four seconds, three, two, one. Gonna sell it right now. Sold, sold, sold on the Pontiac Grand Prix. And the rabbit is left. The rabbit is still in there. And it's uh, David Weiss has got the rabbit at $5. We'll put a clock on the rabbit. All right, everybody's saying good night. <laughs> David Weiss, there you go. 50 seconds, have to hit the clock on it. This is going to be the final of the evening, and I appreciate everything. I appreciate all the love and the thumbs up. Um, so we're going to sell this one off in a second here. 36 seconds left, and there we go. We got David Weiss. Looks like he's got it. Unless Jeff Lang is going in on it, but I know he's, he's into the black walls. David Weiss. Pretty clean little rabbit. 20 seconds. It's going down. There we go. He's got the thumbs are happening and thumbs are coming in. Thumbs are coming in. 10 seconds. 9, 8. Here we go. The last one of the evening. Here we go. It's going to be sold in a second. Last minute shakers. No. Sold, sold, sold. All right. So that's good. That's it for this evening. All right. Thank you very much. I want to thank Mike. He's worked hard. He's the only one here with me. <laughs> so the two of us doing the show, which is cool. I don't mind. And we had the pack, the guys packing. Uh, they've caught up. So we'll get all the boxes out as soon as we can. I want to say thank you to everybody who's bid. Thanks to my brother earlier on. He was in. And there we go. All right. All right. Have a great time. Thank you very much. Uh, thanks, John. And I want to be thankful for all you guys. I really appreciate you guys all coming in and watching the show and get doing all the bids and having some fun here. And I'll try to get on more often. I know it's tough for me to keep talking all this time straight through, but I'll try to do that. Hopefully we'll get three shifts going on in here and we'll get it over that way and it'll be easier that way. And you can tune into each whatever show you want to tune into, which is pretty cool. So, all right, that's a great, have a great evening. Stay out of the cold. And I want to thank you all and God bless you guys and have a good night. Take care. <laughs>